Uh, we just got some great news right before the show. Um, better than we thought. Uh, you won't. Be- it looks like they're really going to do it. They're going to do the same exact thing tonight. They have either not talked to an attorney or they are monumentally, I mean, in either case, monumentally retarded. So they're really going to do it tonight. And they put up their whole plan on Rumble and it's here for the viewing. First of all, they're going to cover what the hell is Bucky's, even though they wrote what the bell is Bucky's, but they're going to like get this. The topics they are going to get into tonight. What's Bucky's y'all. Why is everybody so crazy about it? This is what they wrote. We have, uh, we're giving out some stuff. Steel toe money. They're going to call it steel toe money to the people who keep us going. Join Steel Toe and subscribe to the channel. One lucky member is getting $100 from us. No entry necessary. All they've done is change prize night to to fan appreciation night. Prize night was never the problem. The name of the night was never the problem. And they've added no entry necessary after every contest that they're having. But listen, hear me out. One lucky member is getting $100 from us, no entry necessary. You have to pay to become a member of the channel. That's your entry. You cannot win unless you give them money and join the channel. One member is going to win. What else? One lucky VIP is going to win $100, no entry necessary. Well, again, you have to give them $250 to become a VIP. You saying no entry necessary. This is the whole problem. Actually, entry necessary. Entry very, very, very necessary. As a matter of fact, it's called an AMOE, alternative method of entry. When you require someone to hand you cash in order to be part of a cash drawing, it is a crime. And they're doing it tonight. And no matter how many times they write no entry necessary... That is the exact crux of the issue. Entry is necessary. And a matter of fact, you must provide other methods of entry. I have a real attorney on this tonight, a Minnesota-based attorney. On this tonight, uh, we'll be collecting the minute they break a law. I will release the website information where you will be able to sign up. As part of this class action claim... And tonight we come for the channel. If they do this on YouTube, the channel's gone. The channel's gone. Do you understand? The channel's gone. There are still no guidelines posted. There are still no contest rules posted. They've had a month to do this, and all they've done is change the name of the night from prize night to fan appreciation night, which, again, wasn't an issue, and written no entry necessary after every one of the contests, which, again... They've missed the trick completely. One lucky merch buyer is getting a VIP package or the value of it, which is $250. So what they're doing again is the same thing. Buy merch, any merch, just buy some merch, and you're entered into a drawing to win $250 cash. Illegal. Random viewers will receive gift cards from the Steel to Sponsors. Let's see how they do that. Let's see how they do that. I don't care if they're watching. If they do this on YouTube, they're really retarded. And if they do it, period, they're so retarded. You can't do it. I mean, you can. By all means, please do it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. The paperwork. The paperwork. I'm not bluffing. Again, the minute I've been told I can't give out the form until they break a law. They haven't broken a law. The minute they get they they do the first drawing for someone with no method of entry other than joining and giving them money, paying a membership, whether it's VIP, regular membership, or buying merch, the minute they hold a drawing for that, and the minute they tell you to become eligible for the drawing, just become a member, now it's on. Now there's a crime. And now you're eligible. 
So I can't believe, look, look, I can't believe, I cannot believe they've had a month and done nothing. Remember what they said? Remember when they laughed two, three weeks ago? They go, matter of fact, the next prize night is going to be, you don't even want to know. It's the same thing. It's the same exact thing. They've written it here. It's the same exact thing. There's nothing new here. You just wrote no entry necessary. As if that legalese makes it all okay. No, 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 no. Entry necessary. Entry very, very necessary. We had $2 super chat from Bex. Uh, it's free after you pay for it. Duh. Yeah. So, I mean, look. I really thought they had something. I, I came in here not knowing what to expect. People were messaging me, should we should we get the press involved and stuff? I was like, I was like, we don't know what they're doing. They might have fixed it all. They might have nothing. They might come on here and do it all right. No, no, no. They wrote no entry necessary. All April's hard work. This is what they wrote, no entry necessary. Let's go to the website and see if they have uh, rules up. Again, going live on YouTube without your rules posted, it's over this time. It's over this time. We're coming for the whole channel. They haven't they haven't changed anything. By the way, Ian Hawk gifted five subscriptions on our March to 500. Thank you, Ian Hawk. I'm giddy with this because they've done nothing. They haven't updated their website. They haven't done anything. Still got Twitch up here. Oh. So we're really they're really gonna do it. Payment is still required. No terms and conditions. No matter how much they say no entry necessary, it's like, no, 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 the entry is signing up for your membership. I don't have to explain it. They're either dumb. Look, they had a month. They had a month. We got them if they do this tonight. And I'm I'm serious. We're coming for the YouTube channel. Do this on YouTube, please, idiots. Please. Like, do you think the boys aren't coming? The boys are coming. You've made it clear. You're down to play in the mud, and we're coming. So still no live stream created on YouTube. Okay, here it is. Fan appreciation night. They are going to do it. They are going to do it on YouTube. It's up. Um, you need to go be in there on their page. I need everybody to pull uh, their page up. You got to be watching this. It'd help if you type something in their chat. I know a lot of people are banned from their chat. I actually think it, it even counts if you're watching through our thing. They have to provide alternative methods of entry that are easy. They have to provide accessible alternative methods of entry. You can't put... We're only giving away this money to people who give us money. No entry necessary. It's like, yeah, of course it's not mandatory to enter, but I can't enter unless I give you money. I have to buy a membership, buy a VIP, or buy merch to be entered in those drawings. That is a federal crime. That is a state crime in Minnesota, and it is a crime throughout states in this here United States. And tonight we're getting them. Tonight. We're getting them. So here we go. I really, like, my mind is, I'm sitting here thinking, like, there's still a curveball coming. They can't be this dumb. They're going to go live and go, we're not, you know. The way to do it is to open your chat and just start going, you win, you win, you win. Don't announce it. Don't announce Pat, do they have to li list odds of winning? No. They just have to provide alternative method of entry. That is the key word to this whole thing. They're also just missing terms and conditions. This is the first the first rule on YouTube about writing this kind of stuff is you have to have terms and conditions. And by the way, I think they I think they think this is terms and conditions. Them writing one lucky member gets 100 from us. No entry necessary. That's not a term. That's not a condition. I mean, these guys are, are dumber than we thought. They're dumber than we thought. I, I, I really, I really can't believe they're going to. My mind is, I'm giddy and also, like, sad for them. Like, 
again, this could be your YouTube channel tonight. I, I like, I really want you to know that. Like, again, any normal, humble person would have come out and go like, ah, fuck, you're right. We're playing with fire here. Let's get it in order. You took down every prize night already. And now you're going to do another one? It's like, this is bananas. You took them down because you know you were wrong, and now you're going to do another one? What? What are we missing? What are we missing here? They think by not calling it a prize? It's like, no, 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 no. You're drawing people and giving them money. This is a lottery by every definition. Moody, who has a PhD and is one of the smartest people in the planet, and the chat room, for that matter, um, is piping up in the chat saying, page one of the guide to raffles in Minnesota tells them that what they're doing is illegal. It is so clear. Page one. Page one of the guide to raffles in Minnesota. You're, I mean, they don't understand. It's FCC. It's FTC. YouTube is their biggest. Like, again, your money's going to be gone. Like, they're really going to do it. They're really going to do it. It's bananas. Patrick, read his pinned chat message. Okay, hold on. $15 uh, PayPal, $20 Super Chat. Get two Steel Toe stickers. One merch buyer will get $20. We'll get $250 um, in package. And the links to their stream streamlabs and PayPal, but no contest rules. Yeah, their 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 YouTube will be gone for this. Every person watching this can can report them. Every person watching this can report them for disenfranchising them to YouTube. No contest entry rules. No alternative method of entry. No free method of entry that has to be provided. No, and also, like, there's things YouTube makes you put in your contest rules. Like, they don't even have rules. So how can they put in what YouTube told them to put in? It just, it just, it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt tonight. And we've already got almost 300 watching here, 271. Ooh. Ooh. How do you think this goes tonight? And again, I don't have to tell anybody to do anything. You get 50 of these motherfuckers just to hit report. And again, no, no crime's been committed yet. Wait till they do it. Then gloves are off because they're cocky about it too. They're like, if giving away stuff to members is wrong, I don't want to be right. It's like, you're not giving away. You're running an illegal lottery. And this time we're ready for it. Last time when I saw it, I was like, this can't be. Is this what they're doing? Yeah, it's what they're doing. And tonight we're prepped for it. Tonight we're armed for it. And tonight we need you to be excited that we're going to get, we're going to, we're going to, hey. This is besides the violations they have on the daily. Pile it up. Does YouTube have a lottery scam button? They don't respect dudes who wear man girdles in the penitentiary. Again, I think he'll care more about losing his YouTube channel than the legal repercussions. I I just expected more. I really expected more. They teased it. They were like, uh, you're not going to believe the next prize night's going to be. Pfft. It's going to be. But they got the balls, and they is doing it tonight. And we're here for it. Um, ooh, ooh, scramping. One minute away, guys. We're one minute away. <sighs> They're really going to do it. They're really going to do it. I, I, ooh, sword and scales here. Feeling a bit scrimpy this evening. What the hell is Bucky's? I can't wait for their segment, their cornball segments. What is Bucky's anyway, guys? They wrote, What the Bell is Bucky's? <sighs> I've never seen people, you know, Corey was talking about how much prep they do and how great their show is. It's one of the laziest 
Imagine having a month and not running this by any sort of legal. We talked to PayPal, actually, or we talked to YouTube, and they said we're fine. It's like, let's see. Let's see. Run it again. Remember that? It's here. It's really here. It's really here tonight, guys. So exciting. I haven't been this excited about anything on YouTube ever. The only thing that gets me going like this is the karate high. Oh, boy. Yeah, we are stoked. Go live, Aaron. Let's go, baby. We got prizes to give away. Appreciation to give away. It's just $100 at a time. They're just appreciations. We're giving away appreciations. Hunter T just gifted five memberships on our March to 500. Thank you, Hunter T. Can we please go live, guys? It's minutes past when we were supposed to go live. My, my, my movie and the scrap. Please go live. We just passed 275 viewers. We're all excited for a chance to win. We all are ready for our free entry that you have to provide legally and according to YouTube rules. We're all here for it tonight. We weren't ready last time, Aaron, but we're ready tonight. Go live. Yeah. We are live with Movie and the Scrum. It's prize night. We're doing it. I've uh, seen them yet. Oh, but they're so spaced out. My mom, mom, Movie and the Scrimp. Oh, but they're weird and blunderful. Oh, Scrimpy, she's really keen. They got an eggy mess and iron on. I saw it on the YouTube screen. Oh, oh, oh. Mom, mom, mom Movie and the Scrimp. That's good. Movie and the scrimp, it's prize night. Sorry, fan appreciation, but it's still super illegal. We're gonna do it and just claim that we're dumb and we don't know any better. It's time for movie, movie and the scrimp. Movie and the scrimp. Scrimp and... This podcast is just some dude and chick talking about stuff. A movie and a scrap. Movie, movie, movie and a scrap. Let's go! Bow! Bop, 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 bop. Movie, movie, movie and scrap. Fuck yes. Woo! Ready for some rock, baby? Some prize show. Our awesome customer appreciation night. Oh, boy. Where we're going to be giving out some Stoney's gift cards. Everybody, um, randomly, we're just going to be picking random people. We're going to hand out our gift cards that we've got for you. Sorry about that. Your elbow was out there. Oh, it hurt. <laughs> we're going to, uh, one of our VIPs, we're going to pick out a random VIP. We're going to hand you 100 bucks out of our own pocket. We're going to pick a random uh, member. Everything just crashed, guys. Sorry about out that. Of our own pocket. And we're going to pick one person uh, that bought merch from Steel Toe this month. And we're going to give them either a full VIP package or they can have the 200 He is gulping tonight. It's up to them. What do we want to call this? Customer appreciation night? We Doesn't call. matter what you call it. It's what you do. That's how crimes work. You could call a murder a sweet bullet kiss, and it doesn't make it legal. Chance. Either you take down prize night and it's all over, or you fail. So this is, this is what you put all your eggs in one basket for. So I mean, I don't fail. We're not done making fun of you ever. <laughs> if, you do, if you don't like it, you're free to leave. Otherwise, wow. Just so you just heard him. If you don't get his channel taken down tonight, you fail. That's what Aaron just said to you. So I'm not telling anybody to report anything, but Aaron just told everybody watching this channel, if you don't win tonight and get his channel taken off for these violations, which are going to be flagrant and easily identifiable for any YouTube employee, you fail. So I don't want you to fail, guys. Out to you, and then at the end of the night, I'm gonna pick one of those random people, and I'm gonna put a little something extra. 
Hell yeah. In that envelope for you. Again, Thank you. if that makes me a bad guy, if you're too illiterate to know that that's not a, a lottery or anything like that, I feel bad for you. I know you probably think I'm gaslighting you. You've had a rough life, whatever it is. Then I'm gaslighting you. It's too bad. This is how we do our prize night. Call me arrogant. Call me whatever you want. I'm trying to give people some I'm not money. calling you arrogant. We're calling you a criminal. You can like it. You can hate it. But if you don't like it, we're going to bop you out the front door. Maybe they're just sad it hasn't been them yet. Right. What? Well, hey, maybe we'll hand you a Stoney's gift card know. tonight. Maybe we'll see you in the chat. We'll go, Stoney's gift card. Get in touch with you. We'll, we'll send it out there. Maybe a- Again, that's violation of data laws. You're, you're not checking age. This is COPPA violations. You advertise firearms on this show. It's even triple. Like, I mean. Two stickers tonight. Thank you. Pumpkin Popsums is getting two stickers tonight. Thank you very much. We're back on the stickers. Uh, This is always a hectic night. This is always crazy. My blood pressure is always ridiculously high uh, for these. Oh, my good Christ almighty. This is going to be nuts tonight. Uh, We've got a lot of people picking up stickers tonight. Stickers. I'm ready. Adam S. We've also got... So she's uh, writing down names to pull out of a hopper. And how do you get your name in that hopper? You buy stickers. So are you doing an extra drawing during the prize show for the amount Corey normally would have made that month? <laughs> Corey got so they're really a doing really this. nice uh, going away present from this show. That's for sure. Scott uh, with 20 bucks says, fuck those guys. I agree. Thank this you, was, sir. This was their all-in moment. Let's see if it works for them. Maybe it's rumble for us tomorrow. Who knows? Maybe they'll get their wish. He thinks it goes that fast, like he breaks the rules tonight and his account's gone tomorrow. So that's how it's going to work. He's He will definitely be on tomorrow morning going, see, they didn't get anything to... I'm telling you. <laughs> 15, thank you very much. Am I going too fast for you? No. All right, buddy. He thinks if he's on tomorrow, he won. Appreciate that. So thank all you. of you are now getting two stickers <laughs> from Steel Toe. Andrew K., Getting two stickers from Steel Toe, and we're going to pick one of you guys randomly tonight, and we're going to throw a little bit extra, as you know, in that uh, sticker envelope, if you were, if you will. So that's his other thing, is he's going to try not to say it, but it's in the description that you get value of a VIP membership, which is $250. He thinks he's smart. These are the worst people. You know, this is Dunning-Kruger on full display. April, I need you to show more scrimpage. If you love me, you'll do this for me. Babe, it's me helping you help me. Just do it. But it's always nice to look less that way. Don't you like support? Uh, Phoenix with not wearing the girdle. And then $5.12. Patrick has more people watching than me. Stickers, 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 stickers. We have uh, 20 people less. If we get 20 more people, we have more than him. Armory gift cards we're going to do later. I always did the super chat thing because it was easier just to keep track. Okay, so he is giving away. He's giving fire, giving away firearm gift cards later with no age checks, no, uh, no uh, delegating in, in the metadata in the back end that this is firearm promotion. It's over. It's over. Report it. To the heavens. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> so He's going to tell you that you failed. You know what I mean? Like, this could be reported for so many things. With 15, thank you very much. Thanks, dear. Uh, Brett N. with 20. Brett N. is in. Thank uh, you. Jack Floyd with 15 says, I want Midland gift cards, please. You don't have to give us money for Midland gift cards, uh, but let's throw Jack Floyd. Uh, I can't remember the denominations on Midland. Uh, You're going to have to help me You know me out what? Here. Give me two seconds. I think there are three tens, two twenties, and a 50. So now they just picked a random name in their chat to give firearm gift cards to. They have no idea how old he is. They have no idea. I mean, this is all bad. Ash with 20 says, if you're going to rumble, let us know. I will cancel YouTube premium. Thank you. Uh, Marquise with 15 says, I got dirty, filthy plans with those stickers. All right. Marquise always gets a little five bucks super chat discount on his stickers. He's a sneaky fella. Thank you, sir. Uh, Matthew Jenkins with $20 super chat. Thank you very much. He's in for the two stickers. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Approachable says, can I have one of the 20s to Midland? Why not? Let's give them 20. Uh, Kraken Slappin says, Stoney's is always a good time. Let's hand uh, two 10s to Kraken Slappin. <laughs> He's worthy. Let's hand him two 10s to uh, Stoney's. I'm just going to pick random people out of the chat 
And uh, all right, they have 197 people watching. We have 320. Girl says, "I love Stonies and am broke. Give him, uh, give her, her 20, give her 25 bucks." So stay. now they've stopped the whole thing where you have to pay Thank super you. chats to get a gift card. They think this Thank is you. again. This is their whole thing always. There's always a distraction. See, we did it right this time. Meanwhile, they're doing three cash drawings that you must pay cash to enter. Do not lose focus. They are running a lottery scam. Thank you. Everybody's getting free shit tonight. Quick, Croak. quick. Yeah. Who is the 50? Was it Jack Floyd for 50 to Midland? Again, imagine giving out uh, guns and ammo gift cards to people you haven't vetted their information. This is another flagrant violation of YouTube terms. Oh, that sounds like I don't I'll actually be able to report them tonight as a disenfranchised viewer of the show. I couldn't do it last time, and I haven't decided if I if I am, but since he's kind of mocking me saying like this is your last stand to get get our channel taken down, I think I will report him. Tonight I think as a viewer um he's not letting me enter as required by YouTube regulations and I'm going to report him. So I think I'm going to do that tonight. Give Midland, uh, give uh, Don Lemon's aides 20 to Midland Armor. He's a good guy. Thanks. Uh, Amanda Hug and Kiss says, I need ammo here in Cleveland. Well, I, I, you don't want him to ship ammo. I like it. I don't, I'm not against reporting crimes. You guys think this is like gay ops or like uh, narking and shit. No, no, no. He's ripping off his dumb listeners. Again, Shall I add it up again and find out how much he makes tonight on this giveaway night and appreciation to his fans? It's $1,500. Remember? Like, it's not. He makes three times as much on this show than a regular show. How is that fan appreciation? You have to send your uh, contact information to April or myself so you can get those out. Not to him. You. I have to hear from you. He will not relay your information. I have to hear from you. Apparently, Again, that's not secure. That's not following any sort of data privacy Handling stuff. In luck. <laughs> you have to know your customer. You can't do this stuff. Moody's posting some great information for the Minnesota gambling uh, board. Hold on one second. If anyone did get a Midland uh, gift certificate, this does not negate you from all the yeah. like uh, government yeah. like background checks and shit. It's all kosher. You guys tried very hard. Again. You tried hard. But what, what, am I, what are you, you going to do? You should be used to failing with us by now. Everything is by the book at Midland. They're good uh, people. Tin Man Taylor with 10 bucks. So again, they're doing this, this red herring where they go like, a nice try, everybody, but Midland actually is a licensed gun dealer, so good luck. You can't get them in trouble for selling guns. It's like, no, we're, giving, we're getting you in trouble for giving away firearm and ammo gift cards, which they it's prohibited by YouTube. It's prohibited. We're, we're going to report your channel now. Like, I'm going to report it. I can't control what other people do, but I'm going to report it. My children can't see this. This is bad. Moody's posted details to the Minnesota Gambling Control Board can be found here. This is where you should file complaints about their raffle. It's mn.gov. Fucking Moody, huh? mn.gov slash gcb slash board dash staff dot html. Um, yeah, I mean, this is crazy. When they when they pound their... Look, I wouldn't report them. I wanted them to stop ripping off people. But now they're pounding your chest and going, fuck you, what are you going to do about it? It's like, oh, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> we were all waiting for the party to watch you guys fail, and you didn't show up. That's too bad. That's too bad. I wish what? they'd just have some fun. All talk. Maybe win some prizes. Buy I'll some talk. stickers. Have some fun. These are always so much fun. Win prizes. Buy some stickers. <laughs> uh, Alex, uh, not the... It, you guys don't like fun. You're not buying stickers. Buy some stickers. Have some fun. We're at 357 viewers, and they're at 206. Got it. Yep. Uh, people, I guess, can do with uh, the members, the VIPs. They can do with it Check whatever out they this want. Check out this super chat. After all, boys and girls, not a lottery. It is simply, I love this. People can give us money, but if we try to give them money back to say thank you, if these guys are running a lottery, you couldn't be more pathetic. Are I'm they sorry. real? Like, they can't be this dumb, right? They do understand. She's in for two stickers. Thank and remember, you. get in touch with April if, uh, for I, those two yes, stickers. I cannot send you. Data privacy laws, YouTube firearm regulations, Can age, yeah. age uh, laws, like COPPA stuff. They're in violation of. Oh, where'd he go? No policies posted on YouTube. Uh, 
the lottery. The, the lottery is, is the law stuff. It's the legal that's stuff. That's a great idea. We've done that before in Las Vegas. He did it, too. Didn't yes. you do it, too? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, all right. Are we so all, again, I think I, we're all caught up now. I can't give out the URL for you guys. No crimes committed until he draws a name and gives away money without giving us a method of entry. Still had some left. Right now, the only way to enter is to become a member or buy stickers, okay? Or Stonies? 225. Oh, let's hook him up with some Stonies. So, look, he's fixed the gift card part. We have no problem with the gift card stuff. Now he's doing that correctly. He's doing that correctly now. He's just giving away gift cards. So we fix that. He's not going to make $64 off his gift cards tonight. Uh, I think we already gave you something from Stoney's, buddy. Uh, need he got a 10. So that's all we want. That's fixed. Now we're coming after the other stuff, the violations of YouTube and federal and state regulations. <laughs> well, that too, of course. Uh, Need Trump says, love that Steel Toe show what other show gives back to their fans priceless. Exactly. People don't like that. Right. We're being kind and they hate it. Uh, Rupert with 1999 says, next merch idea, Steel Toe pasties. Ooh. Perfect. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. Some pr- Will they be right five and a half inches across too? It's your livelihood to do something illegal. I know. That We're like totally s- escapes them. It's They just don't get it. Uh, K. Fallen the Great with five bucks says, uh, Stonies, you don't have to give us anything, dude, but give them the last 25. K. Uh, thank you. Gray Duckling says, done for the night. Uh, so listen, interesting is language. You don't have to give us anything to win a gift card, dude, but you do have to give something. You do have to join up memberships to win cash. It is true. They're all little basement trolls. Yeah. Very all blubbery. Of them, all of them bigger tits than I have. I feel like there's a little outward projection there. All like right. Physically? Well, yeah, a lot of that. All right. Let's 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 do some show. We, <laughs> uh, Stonies, do we have left? 350. 350s. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, they liked that line. Thank you, guys. Uh, let's take a look. Again, remember when you calling April's mom fat almost made her bust out in tears live on the show? I got to see who's going to stand out here uh, in order to get the uh, 50 bucks to Stoney's. Who's oh, we got to- some super chats here. I Sorry. Wanna ma- I wanna- uh, beloved chatter, assistant AG of Minnesota is tuned in. I did that to him. Someone who's going to use it. I mean, look, they're making people. If this is true, then that's huge because they're making people pay money. Could have used this. She always goes. He's begging people to report them. He likes narcs. I mean, look. There you go. Mikey's been a good guy for a long time. Thank you, Mikey. Uh, when you when you make that the battle, I never look. He goes, if you guys fail tonight, you fail. I never drew that line in the sand. But if he wants to, uh, okay. Do you know how fucking crazy these trolls are? These Onion Army, they're nuts. Wolf turtle, give him fifty bucks. There if we they've go. got now the got assistant you. AG of Minnesota tuned in, you're so fucked. At least getting like a cease and desist. <laughs> it must be. That'd be cool. It must mean that. Thanks, guys. All right, so that means because uh, what kind of tax fraud is going on with this shit too? I imagine there's all kinds of like a hundred bucks, eight thirty. We're Do you gonna throw just out a, pick it out of the envelope. We're gonna yeah, we're gonna throw a, a gift out to one of our members, and then here's how we're gonna do the members thing. We always slow down the show with the members thing. Sticker, I don't even members. know her. Uh, Seriously, though, I know we look uncomfortable and not confident, but don't mind the scrimping. My aunt owns a law firm. 224 watching them. We're at 360. They get the 100 bucks. If they don't, we'll roll it over and we'll do two of them the next month. Yeah, but then what happens if it gets up to like six, six months down the road? <laughs> Are you then gonna, do we do? Are then you do gonna we keep give... rolling over? Or see, you guys don't know what you do because you don't have policies and terms. It's got to go to one of the members. That's bullshit. It's got to go to one of the okay. members for sure. How about see? Two? There they go. He's saying the crime part out loud. The money has to go to one of the members. It has to go to one of the members. That's the crime. Wow. It really slows down the show when we have to do like six of them. Let's do it the old school way tonight, and then we'll figure out a better way to do it next time. See, they don't have terms and conditions. They make up the rules as they go along. And this is for a cash drawing. This is for a cash drawing. You guys think this is legal? You're out of your gourds. First for running an illegal lottery, you know. I wish you wouldn't say such a thing. <laughs> We've handed out. Got me shaking in my booty. We've handed out hundreds of dollars in free shit, and there's Spurgs. And made thousands on it. And made thousands on it. Again, they'll make $1,500 tonight. We'll go back through later and add it all up. Could get them. 
you could get them by developing original material. You know the part that they've changed, the gift card part? Remember, that only makes them $64. We did the math. $64 is what they're losing. Stickers to Cali. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Very nice of you. Uh, April, keep track of how many that is, please. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's all. God, right. I am slacking. You really are. She's writing down on slips of paper to do this drunk. G-Rob says their condescension is infuriating. Well, then... That's the line in the sand. Now it's time to report. I got to tell you, we almost didn't make it on time tonight because we were busy uh, doing something for Compound Media. I, I know a couple Isn't people. Isn't that just that awful, that, too? I know a couple. Ian Hawk, here comes another five members, 15 total tonight. Uh, That's 15 gifted members by Ian Hawk. Right. Thank you. So we were doing a show. And I think uh, another guy, too, Hunter. Kevin. It's illegal to run. Uh, a raffle online in Minnesota. It's also le illegal to require the purchase of goods or services for entry into a raffle. Report here. Again, Moody's got the links in the chat for this uh, that stuff. It's going to be on, I believe, Friday at 6 o'clock. There's probably an online form, cut and paste, very simple stuff. Uh, <laughs> which, if somebody wants to write up a little thing, you know. The subject matter. The topics weren't funny. Yeah, I, I think... Uh, <laughs> I, I think the topics weren't that funny, but goddamn, did we make it work. So check that one out. Uh, 21 Gun Salute. Those guys are real. A lot I know a, a lawyer who needed outside help to make sure his gin raffle was the. I mean, yeah, it's very complicated stuff. Dealing with that bottle. We, we're not retarded. We understand. Where's your nice gophers when I got you? This is, it's up on, it's up on the fucking. Uh, oh, the key ring? The key ring, yeah. Key holder, whatever. That one is key terrible. Key master. It's well, I'm sorry. Gatekeeper. I'm so sorry. All right, guys, if you want a couple of stickers tonight. I got an email that says do so. Raz of Chaz with 10 bucks says for Corey. Oh, wait, I'm behind in the chat. Dude, FYI, my handle is blank and they will not let they will not tell me how to enter without buying anything. Well. Oh, there's a guy in the chat asking them how to buy thing, how to enter without buying stuff. Reminiscing, you know, what big gay F words we were and this and that. Woo. That's the best news I could have gotten all day. That really was what I was thinking when I was I apparently won a Stoney's gift card. I was just saying dumb shit in the chat, and I was like, I'm here. I get it. I live it in Albany, New York. Fuck yeah. How many of these Stoney's gift cards go unclaimed, and then Aaron just goes down there and drinks the night away on them? You know. But the best going forward. And Corey made himself a nice chunk of change going out the door. God bless. First time ever. I think 500 bucks or something like that. 450, wow. 500 bucks. Yeah. Nine weeks of pay. Cool. And he's like, he just texted me later in the day. He goes, these people are so fucking mad that this whole thing is cool. He goes, they, they're waiting for me to drop some kind of a nuke. And I'm like, who's these people that are mad? I, I turned it off when the stream was over. Nobody's watching Corey. Nobody's mad. The, the gaslighting is so insane, and now Corey's doing it. Uh, yeah, it is always interesting to me, and I think we just got done talking about this on the 21 Gun Salute podcast, is just people being upset towards, like... There's five like, pounds uh, minus the YouTube yeah. tax from Edinburgh, yeah, Mikey, about, thank you, no, and then another one. last night with the car, Mr. Beast giving that woman the car yeah, with the decal. Right. Here's the link again from Moody. F. Guys, you don't have to be upset for Corey. Yeah. Or us. Everything's fine. Uh, Derek Chauvin says, MLC was all about... Everything's fine. So ...religiously, but it's really hate-watching Cope Fest this past week. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, we love hate-watching. different kind of shows. Current like federal show. law requires Steel Toe to withhold 24% in federal income taxes, and current Minnesota state law requires a lottery to withhold 7.25% in Minnesota state income taxes. We're doing kind of more of a like refined attack, record. attack, attack. Which so, one is Snooky? Yeah, I don't, well, uh, fat Snooky obviously would be Chad. So I think that Snooks. one's that one's pretty easy. Aww. But yeah, when it comes to like all that stuff, it's like all these podcasts that like don't even do what we do seem to get really upset with us. What do you do other than complain about podcasts that don't do what you do? That's your whole podcast. These guys don't get what we do. Show, go to yeah. your show. You'll be fine. You're I promise. You know what? All right. Guys, don't be so insecure. You'll be fine. You're Have a pine on me from Edinburgh, Mikey. Another five pounds. Thank you. Uh, Von Kaiser with 15. He's getting a couple of stickers. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Uh, there, I have nothing but shit left over from this morning's show. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we didn't get to Does he think he's getting uh, hired at Compound Media and doesn't care about this YouTube channel anymore? I hope so. Fucking gross, actually. That we didn't have We know what Compound pays, and also, you know... 
felt, you know, a little intimidated. The compound's not hiring him. Don't be, don't even joke about that. That we weren't able to get through any kind of story. Bob Levy was joking about Shuley picking up Steel Toe. That's delusional, too. Uh, I, they were joking about, like, Steel Toe could come out really looking good tomorrow from the Ray interview. It's like, no, they can't. They're both going to come out looking dumb and boring. VIPs and picking members and giving away stickers and... We already gave away hundreds of bucks worth of prizes to people. Uh, now we can get into some of the, the stupid shit okay. that we get into. Uh, there's some new rules in baseball this year, but as the catcher... He's gulp, gulping heavy tonight. What's happening? Are people joining? Or, or this What's is happening? Be saying this. I don't think this is an actual rule. Like You can still, when, when the catcher needs a new ball to throw out to the pitcher, he'll mm-hmm. put his glove back like Oof, this. Not a belly itcher. Throw it back to the pitcher. Okay. Sometimes the ump will just straight up throw it to the pitcher himself. Hmm. Well, at a game this weekend, a Blue Jays spring training game, there was a miscommunication between the catcher and the ump. And I think the ump must have caught, like, somebody fucking his wife the night before. Uh-oh. KB or is a fan of NLO, NLO, not Corey. He's not going to do the Vegas thing. Oh, your balls are rotten. We're going to set it up without him, and he's going to beg to be a part of it, and then we're going to get him for, like, 200 bucks. And this happened. Really low ball him, you know? Kimbro says, I don't like that call. Now, here's the... <laughs> so, the ump does look like a dick. <laughs> yeah. Because he went to put... So, the catcher put his hand back. Coffee is for Jeff Closers. Am I right? Get it? Ump goes to put the ball Beloved chatter with a dollar and 99 says Madoff was a they don't know what we do situation. Should be okay. Yeah. Oh, haha, that was stupid. Yeah, just continue the game. I have a feeling that's not how it went. Like I said, the ump, I don't know if he caught his wife fucking somebody or what the deal was, but he was in a mood. Kimbrough says, I don't like that call. Now, here's the action right here. <laughs> and- <laughs> uh, JG with 499. Thank you, buddy. MLC and NLO, best shows around. What a nice boy. What a nice boy. And then boy. pulling the glove away when he thought maybe the ump wasn't going to eh, give it to him. It's a little spicy. It's not, See, other people were saying, oh, yeah, the catcher was being a little cunty. I don't think he was being cunty. Do a uh, drawing. The, the, Do a uh, drawing. Oh, we want, want the crime. We want the crime. I don't like that. Kimbra says, I don't like that call. Now, here's the... I don't like that call. Uh, imagine them, like... Trying to intersperse their crime amongst baseball stories. It's like, well, guys, we have so many killer stories from this morning. You won't believe what I got from the Louder with Crowder Reddit about race today. That's what they do. Uh, Ooh. Oh, Spaghetti Tooth Nurse is here. Um, I'm glad you're feeling better. I have a very unhealthy relationship with this show and I need to keep it going. I, uh, you know, Spaghetti Tooth Nerd, I was browsing, um, the recent NLO orders and I couldn't help notice a little, I don't want to say anomaly in my orders, but let's just say uh, it looks to me like someone ordered something and had it shipped to someone else from our store, which could be very, very triggering for someone receiving nobody likes onions merch, uh, you know, unsolicited. Spaghetti Tooth Nurse is glad I'm feeling better, though, and I'm glad uh, to be feeling better as well. Nurse, it's nurse, not nerd. <laughs> Most nurses are nerds, I'd bet. There's cameras everywhere. we got to replay everything 300 times and overanalyze. Oh, we'll be replaying this as well as the attorney general. I don't know if that was true about the attorney general, whoever wrote that. Is that true about the attorney general watching? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Raz. Uh, Eddie, Eddie. Um, I was being nice, said Spaghetti Tooth Nurse. So... Do you want to reveal it, or should we let it be a surprise? Which, dude, I you you and the you and the girlfriend, or you and the wife, or whatever it is, you got to get that shit straightened up before the regular season because you're gonna do some damage out there. Yeah, you should never go into a game having to. Who miss sent the Red Bar merch? Yeah. Who's Dill- listening? I have no idea. I, I know he told you only three people ordered it, but that's not true. That Eventually, got to track down the the 
down Scorch from O&A. Yeah, that, huh? that computer can't fix itself right now. You've killed the umpire. Which, again, if you get rid of umpires, you My merch is coming out. to me, but I applaud the idea. Who knows? At least if you hit an umpire, it can stand up for itself. Uh, MTC. Somebody should send some to Steel Toe. This wasn't sent to Steel Toe, by the way. It's sent to a very unlikely... Wait. Now I understand. No, that's yeah. not good. Now I get it. Uh, yeah, there's some... Yeah, Alex Bernal says the robot... They have 249 watching, and we're at 407. Easy. That's what I'm showing. Pull out a little tiny cattle prod. And then 386 now. <laughs> what? Oh, no, we're down. going up again. Oh, oh, no, that's, down. That's for hey, sure. Spaghetti Tooth Bird. Uh, John, I like what I'm seeing. Uh, I like it so much I stay up at night and jerk it. April caught me last night, and I had to play it off. Like, but just know, every drop of my love is for you. This feels, Can't wait to see you. That felt like a skakel. Moms have this issue where they, um, they, they're disgusting narcissistic alcoholics. And they, sometimes, they, well, they hide it in their slogans like it's wine 30 or it's wine it's o'clock. Wine o'clock. I am a wine mom. And they drink a shitload, but they think if they drink a shitload out of like a cup with a funny saying on it right. at 11 o'clock in the morning while their kids in the house, uh-huh. they're not being an alcoholic. Mimosa. Well, this gross mom has a 10 year old daughter. And here's a in their chat. This guy keeps saying, how do I get the prize without giving you money? Stop deleting this question or not so subtle. Maybe not so subtle. So just for law enforcement, they are deleting this kind of stuff. White trash, single mom problem. It's an everyone problem. Right. It's not just an American problem. We export our shit, you know, mostly through reality television. Uh, One mom from England was left guffawing. I don't like reading these. Ew. Okay. That word shouldn't be used. Um, da, 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 da. That's a guffaw. Guff- we're guffawing. I don't now. even know in 2020. You look cute today, Patrick. Guffaw. Thanks. I don't know if it's guffaw, what that means. One mom from England was left guffawing after her 10 year old daughter presented her with a card that she made in school dedicated to her love for vodka <laughs> and even had help from teachers to make it. Oh, no. No. The, the teachers can't be helping. Well, I mean, they um, can help. I, I, like, why wouldn't you, with your money, reach out to a lawyer and just have them take a look at it? Because any lawyer would go, whoa, 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 no, 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 like, don't do this again. <laughs> like, immediately they'd go, like, yeah, there's a lot of spaghetti here to untangle. Tooth bird. Everything is fine. Oh, your mom's a, a complete alcoholic? Oh, let's help you make her a card. Oh, you like playing with trucks? First of all, speaking of alcoholics, these two haven't stopped drinking in a while, you know? I can just hear it now. Oh, guys, your mom really likes drinking? Well, you know what? It's probably better, and she's got your best interests at heart. Like, she wants you to learn to drink at home with her. Right. You know, it's safe there. Again, the the teachers, A, shouldn't even know that that's hey, the big A. If they do, they should be pulling the child aside and asking it questions about life. I'm banned from their right. chat. Yeah, that presents interesting questions about the, the uh, entry, too, like... Dana Jones' daughter, Jalen, that's a single mom mm. kid's name, uh, came home this from school is, with a uh... special note for her that read, you love vodka, girl, adorned with a girl. photo of a purple bottle on the front. Sword and Scale Somebody says, added the words, I'm here the for the crime. The inside, oh, no. Boy, oh, boy. With heart. That's what she I said. That's <laughs> for everyone. Nobody loves vodka this much. Nobody loves vodka. That's my side project. Love vodka. For a 10-year-old to pick up on it. A and lot. Think, right. And then it's so normal to this 10-year-old that it's a funny joke to her in school. Meanwhile, there's one kid in school who's got bruises all over his rib cage, oh, and no. he's like, vodka may be funny. But super this- chat. Super oh, chat. I'm super, super chatty. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Do you guys like super chats? Yeah, because I like super chats. Yeah. <laughs> April's Shit. mom likes eating. Jones even added the words, I heart vodka across the front. Inside, she decorated it with hearts. It was really unexpected. The 30-year-old mom of four revealed to Kennedy News. Does anybody have access to their chat that can say that uh, Patrick's putting up pictures of April's mom? You're the the one pouring Again, I don't even have to do it. It just really gets to her. If you're not the one pouring tumblers out before noon, who is? Because Kids that's don't. probably a problem. Patrick zooming in on April's mom. No, Kids. pretty free. Hey, Patrick zooming in on April's mom. Vodka just ran. April and Aaron have become uh, a lot of 
Well, April and Aaron have become alcoholics, and April is a pill head alcoholic. Wow, how do you know that? That's an accusation. Sherlock Melton uncovers crime and lie. I mean, this is common sense. This is how dumb they are. I watched him do it, and I was like, they can't be really doing that, right? I don't know. Go easy on the bottle a little bit. Broken shells and yolk. Pan sizzles with gross albumin. Eggy mess divine, sautéed shrimp and onions, a sizzling and savory dish, tasty, fragrant delight, ranch dressing so rich, dripping from my movies, savoring each drop. That's great. I'm really loving whoever's doing that. Uh, I don't get the notifications right away or see it later, but I can't even remember now. But whoever's doing this steel toast slam poetry is really on to something. This, is, this could be a little coffee table book. It was like, oh, my life. And laughed. Ew. Oh, English people talk like assholes. They do. They talk like assholes. What the hell? Um, I thought Melton alluded to having an attorney on his stream with him. I, I, what oh, the fuck? Good laugh. Oh, I laughed. First of all, this is being done as a favor to the show. You think this guy's like. To take away from that. There used to be a day where if your kid was talking about booze in the classroom, just even <laughs> mentioning it, I'd be like, oh, you know, there might be a little too much going this on. This isn't like a. Uh, a pot smoking comedian who like took the LSATs. It's a lawyer. A lot. It's good, honey. Patrick, please leave them alone. Fuck no. I'm sorry. New York. They've challenged everyone to turn them in. Now it's like I'm reporting. Okay. Now again, they haven't done their drawing yet. They could still give me a way to enter, so I can't really report anything yet. Well, of course she wrote that. If she doesn't, the angry... They could, at the last minute, this could all be a great, great troll, and they could be like, just kidding, go enter here and have a website form. British people, you know? However, there is a catch. That's how easy it would be to fix this, by the way. Drink vodka. Sure, sure, sure. Oh, don't worry, though. Uh, It wasn't what you're thinking. Did somebody do the comment? ...ending herself by saying she doesn't drink a lot. Uh, She thinks her daughter got the booze confused with her favorite bottle of gin. Oh. Pat is sharing family photos at the moment. Okay. Big photos. <laughs> so the oh, daughter no. Oh, no. That says my mom. My mom, my movie vodka, and the screen. Hey, not appropriate. I do not drink a lot of vodka. I drink a shitload of gin, though. I only bought vodka that one time. It was on sale, and I couldn't afford the gin. But her mom doesn't mind, and she's pretty proud of her <laughs> child for her. Sassy sense of humor. With my mind, know my money, uh, and my money make a mind. Her daughter, she's quite a comedian. Yes, Sounds a comedian like. that's going to end. We got up some her snooper chats that I a need to. Uh... She continued about the card. She was quite proud of it. She said that the <laughs> teachers said it was great. I need to know more about these teachers. Uh, little Emmy says she can no longer stand the sound of Aaron's voice. Wow. They let a lot of shit go. Exactly. Yeah. Don't you want that? Little again? Emmy's affected, though. You know what I mean? Not, not if the alcoholic mom is a Little mom. Emmy is not. That's just the, that's the mom, not the teacher. What if this card was the warning that the kid like, kid was trying to, like, wave a little red flag in front of the teachers and the teacher? English <laughs> people talk like assholes. I mean, everybody I talks like assholes. Teacher. Jack Burns is looking forward to this Vegas thing you've been talking about. Tired of everything being on the East Coast. Be nice to meet you in person, finally. I take that as a threat, and you will be hearing from my... If she is or not, I'm just going to um, the story. Haberdashery attendant. This dad isn't really in the picture. I don't think he's in the picture. We're going to try. We're going to try. She about the card, saying she was quite proud of it. The teachers thought it was great, and they'd help her to cut the bottle out to stick... I hope Cheetos bottle. puts money on my books so I don't get turned out too much in Minnesota State Prison. You think I'll get conjugal visits? Not for Scrimp, but for Corey. So they are totally convinced. Oh, she's upset. After asking uh, many questions about how to gain entry without paying or buying something, they deleted every comment on the subject. Also, I commented the same two words. Um, Aaron Pearl said disgusting narcissist and control. And that was also hidden. They uh, are not banning me, just hiding my comments. Seems relevant legally. It was the brother. Oh, that makes sense. So now they're hiding people who are trying to clue their listeners that this is a scam. So people are there to warn their listeners not to fall for this scam, and they're hiding it. Yes, I and you know me. I sure do love attacking a single mom. Uh, put Citizen M in the drawing, says Jeremy H. Uh, give uh, give Citizen M Oh, that's two. funny because that's not even Citizen M. Oh, that's not Citizen M? 
No. Well, give Citizen M two uh, <laughs> that's, stickers. That's funny. Somebody bought Citizen M a couple of stickers tonight. I I got you, Shan. Shan. Shan, Shan uh, and everybody else well, got you know who you are. I got you. Uh, make sure. I don't want to read that. You, Sorry. Uh, you I almost. April, your information, and we never mind. Sent out to you. All right. I got your email. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> I see what you did. If you want to uh, buy a little steel toe merch and get a couple of those stickers, uh. I did remind him that it's not long until Father's Day, and that quickly took the smile off his face. Jones joked, it'll be his turn. He made a single mom joke. Yeah, he also, like, did a whole thing about, drunk as you are. like, women who, like, stay with, the, stay with the father. What's wrong with these fucking people breaking up with kids? It's like, ew, bro. Uh, for his uh, two $10 super chats. Thank you. Bro. I asked how to participate and got labeled a troll. Uh, have uh, are going to get a couple of stickers, and we're going to pick one of you randomly tonight. And to go with those couple of stickers, we're going to throw you, we're going to gift you a little uh, VIP package or the monetary value of said package. Totally up to you. We just like saying thank you and throwing. He's a little getting looser with, with the language. Uh, he said a little something extra. Now he's saying the monetary value. He's admitting they're going to give cash, hundreds in cash. <laughs> That it's just a little sad to me. Just no judgment. Allergic to kindness. Uh, Bobby with uh, 15 bucks. Bobby B is getting a couple of stickers. There we go. They love these stickers. Uh, this story is one of those stories where you might feel bad for the person immediately. But when you check the street smarts of this story, you go, ah. you know, it's, it's like one of those stories where you see a person get ripped off. Mm hmm. But then you read the details and you're like, Hi. yeah, b maybe better. The guy who uh, uh, won the Stoney's gift cards, if you want to get them to me, have him send them to you first, then to my P.O. box. Otherwise, he's going to get suspicious. If they come to Vegas, he'll get suspicious. Have him send them to you. The Nigerian princess in distress. He won't know where they come from by the time I get them. I, I don't necessarily side with the pranksters. Oh, really? I, okay. I just don't side with the people being pranked. Like, look, pulling okay. pulling a ruse on people is a bad thing. Like, doing the Nigerian bad. prince mm -hmm. thing, that is a bad thing. We don't like scams here. But wow, if at the same time you hook someone in and they are so stupid that they fall for it, <laughs> right. that doesn't mean that I immediately have to think that that person's a good guy. Hey, old person, we have your grandson. He's in jail. You can bail him out as long as you get a... $25,000 money order to the Walmart right get, Yeah, now. get us get us some uh, gift cards to Target. Because that's how people <laughs> pay their bail all the time. People say that shit and get away with I it. I know. Though. I mean, it's really hard. I do feel bags are old and probably scared, but I do like have a hard time understanding how you fall for it. Right. Whoa. So this guy. Uh, <laughs> oh, whoa. His he emptied his savings. Ooh. To buy a Somebody Hellcat. just. Uh, right, how much, I mean, Hellcat's what? Brand new Hellcat. I was gonna over a hundred grand. Oh really? Shit. Somebody just sent me a photo of Cheetos. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm off. Side yeah, piece. Know, wrong, and wow. Right. But uh, I, I let's I just say, say she got enough uh, cake back there for two birthdays. Uh, when it comes to this guy, though, the stickers are their money. And also, the worms, they come out of the ground at night and take all your money. It's not an illegal raffle. We do a fun scam. I mean, scrimp. I mean, show. 26000 is painfully cheap. No. Holy shit. This picture of Stoney's bar owner, Cheetos, is bitch, uh, is ba-bam. Ba-bam. Uh, with a couple of stickers. Thank that would you very be 30, much, buddy. By the way. Uh, that's 30 people. There you go. Uh, perfect. I don't know if it's his wife. Uh, Ask them why in their chat why Stoney's girlfriend is so fat. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, Cheetos. Why Cheetos? Up a poll. We're going a little bit crazy there. Uh oh. Little bit crazy there. Let's uh. Uh oh. Let's what do they do? That, and then do fucked. There we are. Perfect. Oh no, you did it right. Good job. Okay. So let's check this guy out. He's the victim of a scam on one hand, but on the other hand. So they're talking about scams while they run a scam. This is, it's Chester Cheeto. Yeah, why is Cheeto's wife so fat? I'm not kidding you. Like, her ass, every cheek looks like. I actually tracked the car because. That's a picture. That's a real photo of her. Wow. This poor guy here gave 26000 Is it legal if they say the word stickers instead of entry? It doesn't matter what they say. It matters what they do. Again, you can call murder. 
lovey-dovey huggy cakes. That doesn't make murder legal. What they're doing is making people buy something in order to be entered into a drawing for cash. That is illegal, period. They can call it giving out candy to kids. They can call it anything. They can use any language they want. They can say no entry necessary. They can say whatever they want. That work can be done over the weekend. Patrick is showing your kids report cards on his stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that one. That's a ballsy scam to be running. Patrick is showing your kids report cards on his stream. Holy shit. Will they buy that? That's so fucking funny. But don't you put like a lot of your information down and, and don't they have to check on it and your driver's Insurance license? Insurance too. I don't know. By the way, if you saw my story or tweet today about what happened last night with this insane man. He never had to rent a car. Not yet. What's crazy is this guy threatened me and said he was coming over and I was like, I got to get up at 3 a.m. So I'm going to bed. <laughs> like, good luck. Knock if you get here and you're angry. Which is absolutely insane. No one approached my house last night from any direction. Uh, my cameras log every license plate number that drives down my street. Yeah, I'm nuts. I'm nuts with that shit. The guy who rented it, like this wasn't even a Hellcat that he sold him. I got that good, good. No, this is just a base. It's called Unify. Look it up. Fucking hood scoops or whatever the fuck you call it. Like, see, like and they plastered the. Uh, not the signage, but the, like the emblems and the decals on it. I want to feel bad for this guy. Truly, I do. I yeah, want Rodney to Wayne's bad. brother. I but I talked to Rodney Wayne today. Apparently, he was mad about his kid yeah. being in the stream uh, when we were like scrolling through his photo. This kid was in there for a second. I want to feel bad for this guy. I edited it out. I would have edited it out if he contacted me about that. You don't have to threaten us in your your short fuse brother over here. And by the way, if you see a picture of this brother. You and go, like Rocky went to Polly and Rocky too. Like, hey, Polly, you want you want to buy this car? You want to pick up the payments on this car, Polly? Nobody does that in real life. Nobody buys cars sight unseen. Hey, okay. you, come here. Hey, hey, you, come here. April just said nobody buys cars sight unseen, as if Carvana wasn't the biggest thing in the world for the past three years until it shat itself. As if a million other competitors from Vroom to every dealership in the world doesn't sell online. Nobody buys a car sight unseen. It's like, okay. Your savings, though, as an 18-year-old, that's not doing Well, so you bad. don't need more. Well. You, f- you <laughs> fucked that up. Here's the look of the car, but the car still exactly what it was with our tracking system on it. That's how I was able to find it. Ask who's fatter, Zen Rhino or April's mom. Again, it's it's a scam. It's bad. That'll get the mod and April fired up. People, sure, agree with you. One. By the way, it's April's mom however, for sure. However, you gotta be a little bit smarter than that. You don't get that money back, right? No. Uh, Andrew says, I own a 2017 Hellcat Challenger. Well, good for you, buddy. That That's always been my car. Like, if I've got extra, like, fuck you money someday down the road, that I'd love one. You but won't. Probably not. Uh, Patrick Bay with 20 bucks says, just sold a fake Hellcat to some dumb sap. Want to trade some <laughs> stickers for cash? Thank you. Uh, two stickers going to Patrick. Thank you very much, buddy. Thank you. Uh, appreciate that one. Again, you're not buying the stickers. Nobody ever emails them. It's like, don't forget to mail me my stickers. This is such a fucking uh, fake fucking thing. Uh, Derek yeah, Chauvinist or- has infiltrated the NLO chat. He does my bidding like a good little bitch. Uh, <laughs> Who's Derek Chauvinist? She can't send them to you. So we got to get your information from you so we can send those out to you. That's a big part of the whole thing. Again, asking for people to mail information without a data handling plan is a crime. There is against violations, like, or, or sorry, against YouTube regulations. They're just dumb. They're just dumb. So throw Dustin H in there. Thank you. As well. Thank you. Thank you. I'm very, very feel. There you go. Well, thank you very much, guys. Appreciate that. Gray Duckling with 199. I own a Dodge Stratus. The minute they do a drawing and didn't give us a chance to enter, we have been wronged and we can report. Just gave away all the free sh- now, they've already broken YouTube regulations, so you can't report them for that. Hundreds of dollars worth of gift cards. Uh, so, yes, you, uh, you have a chance 
every single prize night, listener appreciation night. I'm going to answer your question as though you're being an honest dealer with me. All right, uh, Joe Biden. Let's go check in with him. We, we didn't cover this. So they just said, how do I win without entry? And he goes, uh, we, again, we just gave out hundreds of gift cards. So you're not being honest, okay? You're not being honest. It's like, no, the cash drawings. You know what we're asking. This is how Ray's interview is going to go in the morning. This is how it's going to go tomorrow. It's gonna He's going to go like, again, we just randomly gave out stuff to our chat room. It's like, first of all, why'd you change it? Why'd you change it? Because they had a super chat for it last month and every month before that. Why'd you change it? Remember? The easiest way is if you just chat a uh, dollar for the 10, five for the 25, 10 for the 50. It's like, what? What? How'd you give them away now? How come you weren't able to count super chats today, but you can count them every other day, but not for Corey? I mean, these guys are just shitheads needs a handler or that Joe Biden's April's really doing upset thing under his own accord. April's upset. And, and what Joe happened Biden in the just, chat? You know, would wander around aimlessly if he didn't have someone telling him where to go. Sure. Then Runway you, lights. Yeah. Then you don't know <laughs> shit. What? You don't know anything about Joe Biden. Aww. He's his own man. He knows what he's doing and he's got his shit together. I give you this from yesterday. Uh, yeah. Two days ago. I think this was again. This guy is just yes, sir. Down the ramp. And we have people lined up on the. She left have a over scar there. on that left cheek. What's right. going on? Union leaders and workers. Hey guys and ladies. He looks like a robot. It's funny because they're like walking him down there, like he's the blind lady in Red Dragon. They're like, yes. all right, twelve steps to the floor, three people over to the left, four more steps here. Okay, look at them, acknowledge them. Yes, wave. All right, naturally, there you go. Look Just look at all my scrimp, y'all. My scrimp is the best grin inside of Louisiana. Now down the road, got up in my scrimp. And it ain't worth the slime and new paper and sold on. Just look at all that earl on my scrimp. That's okay. <laughs> I got off. <laughs> so, so the guy's like, you got this blue mark coming up right here. Oh. President just blows, blows the fuck past right past it. it. He's like, all right, you got a blue mark? I'm um, okay. getting intelligence. You can always email me during the show, Patrick, at nobodylikesonions.com. I love your tips. I'll keep you anonymous. Sure. He's got to try and get him to the goddamn blue mark. Should I corral him? Yeah, it's like trying to get a kid to the checkout at the grocery store. They, just, nope, they, not there. Nope, over, uh, over here. You got they sent the biggest guy they had to try to, like, encourage him to go a certain way. Yeah. <laughs> your mark is going to be the blue one to the left. How y'all doing? You've got a blue mark, and that's okay. <laughs> he just realizes this fucking guy isn't listening to me. Well, you can't insult the guy. I don't know. Whoever emailed me that screenshot See, just now, I don't know what that is or means. Better the economy's doing. Cool, I guess. So if you have this big just a fucking picture of their right chat here. with a big old flag. Yeah, that means, and it's got There's a flag nothing on like it, it's so you know just the red fox X. mad guy. Oh, sure. Okay. So even though this was probably made in some foreign country. They put an American flag on it so you know it's good. You know that nice black suburban back there, too? It's looking shiny. Absolutely. Everything's coming up spades. We got another steal, bro. Uh-oh, is there steel yeah. toe people oh, infiltrating? Oh, oh, oh. After he helps April clean up egg vomit, Derek likes to blow air into my butthole. <laughs> help you get started. What the hell? I don't know who you are, Derek, but you've pissed uh, off whoever's doing the yeah, text to speech chat. One guns, guys, and we were just like, it, it's just. There's no way that, like, he's well. Like, it's just he's not no. a well guy. I don't, I feel bad for anyone who kind of has to defend him. And handle him. Right. Because it's just like, you you can believe in the things he believes in. You can Somebody's, believe in the I don't know why you keep sending me the, okay. this screenshot, you can guy. All that shit. Everybody's entitled Ape. to opinion. Nobody knows. What What am I looking for? Use your words. You just keep sending me screenshots of Red Fox Mad in their chat. But you can't look at him as like use your fucking person. words and go, oh yeah, he's totally fine. He's got all his faculties about him. He's all there. No way. Uh, no pen fifteen fathead with a twenty dollars super chat says, enter Amy Elizabeth. All right, she's gonna get the stickers. Uh, mm -hmm. Amy, uh, make sure that you uh, you throw uh, April the contact information. And we'll get you those two stickers. I think Amy is one of ours. Uh, you're getting some stickers tonight. Thank you. Uh, Somebody paid fifteen dollars for that, Thank you, sir, or twenty bucks, uh, buddy. So we're over forty. We're at forty-two. Forty-two. Uh, all right. So another uh, scam victim. God. This I, one. In, this why one are they doing scams? Oh God. Sorry. You know. Wait. Who? 
Who do you exactly think is smarter? Uh, the people in Florida. Uh, you, oh, right. What? I, I understand. <laughs> Like it's Stop it's sending me random chat right, stuff right, if you're not going to explain it. You knock it off. There's the people who are like, yeah, freedom, fucking Florida. We know it better than you. And then there's the guys who, like, reach into a snake's asshole and pull eggs out of it. And then sell them. Yeah, like, I guess you're right. There's a couple different kinds of Floridians. Yeah, so you got to pick and choose. I just would expect <laughs> that in Florida, land of the free, home of the brave. They Paradise. Would be, I want them to be a little sharper. Uh, Mindy Lee says, did you get the PayPal dono for Riley Johnson under my name? We got Mindy mm. Lee, don't we? Yeah, but I don't think we put it down put for it that Put it under Riley person. Johnson, then. Okay. There you go. Put it under uh, Riley. Absolutely. Uh, Citizen M says, I believe in what Biden stands for. I would also let an alt-right babe like Brittany Venti hit me. Politics are Jesus. complicated. Well, what? He likes Brittany Venti. I, guess. I thought you were done with her, Citizen M. Yeah. Pungent scent wafting we from seafood so fragrant, yet no, somehow still no. desired. Ashton False Ashton confidence Ashton blooms. Ashton Delusion Ashton leads Ashton to downfall. Ashton. Wisdom is humble. Tough steel once guarded, now shattered. Ashton. Boots no longer shield feet from the world. She's got a tit job and it looks good. Good stuff. Another steel toe slam poetry banger. Very nice, respectable size. I'm going to put together these as a clip. You told me she got new tits, mm -hmm. but I don't think I actually saw them. So she I can show you later if you'd like. She didn't go too big? No, they're very nice. Right. I like them. Uh, Zen Rhino says, Brittany Venti got a great set of tits, but her face looks like she got hit with a shovel. I mean, Zen Rhino looks like Wreck-It Ralph got into the liquor cabinet when he was a child and never recovered. Uh, April's on there. By the way, April. Why not? I Easter like night on Simcast. Well, I, I mean, no after, problem with after Zen Venti. Rhino comes in here and made me say something like that. What is like Zen going to do, embarrass me in front of my friends? That's true. Uh, Citizen M says Ashton Birdie rejected me. Venti got a boyfriend. Yeah, he got a, a. You know what? That doesn't stop some people. Yeah, Citizen M. I'm when are we gonna get to the main story tonight? What the hell is Bucky's? Am I right? Fields go. Citizen M is into hammerhead sharks. Apparently, what? Oh, that is remarkably mean. <laughs> it's ridiculously mean. <laughs> that like actually made me uncomfortable. That was so mean. She's uh, very pretty. A hammerhead shark. <laughs> Remember when Citizen M had us all convinced he liked uh, Steel Toe? Says, Melanie Mack is gorgeous. That big-eyed girl just does something to me. It, like Even the compliments can't be clean okay, compliments. Rupert, I have to know this because I follow Melanie and everything, and guess what? I don't know why. Who are Rupert know, and Melanie? Her. What is he talking about? This is wild. She's probably like a Republican chick, She gets right? thousands and thousands of likes on just a very... She gets movie. thousands of likes, and, and she can. gets thousands of thumbs up. She on gets thousands of likes. Now, all Come those, on, uh, everybody now. They dyed their hair well, blue, and they've pierced everything. Kumia did cover the other day that apparently being more conservative or right-leaning makes you hotter. I think that was her. I mean, look. <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I, I think maybe. Look, I'm not saying. No, no, I just noticed his shirt, Tack Comedian. That's funny. What a funny, funny shirt. You guys follow the Aaron M. Holt t-shirt tracker at M. Holt, I-M-H-O-L-T-E, underscore T, the letter T, M. Holt, underscore T, on Twitter. We'll let you know what Aaron's shirt means, how long he Wears it, how often he wears it. That's a person. Yeah, I didn't mean that. As it, like, I meant that look has a Twitch streamer look to it. It's not an insult. By God, she's got a family. By God, she's got a Twitch account. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, she's a gamer. Okay. Okay. I follow her. She's everywhere. a gamer. Like, she's a gamer. She seems to get a lot of attention, and I never knew what it she's was. She's cute. She There's different factions fighting in chat, in their chat or my chat. No, I don't like the full sleeve. Yeah. but I uh, have no problem with the sleeve, but she, most girls don't. She kind of reminds you're a little bit more muscular. I love when Zen Rhino tells yeah. women in his chat that they yeah, can get it. Like a, she's like a dark she can too. get it. It's like, can she, Zen Rhino? I mean, Jesus Christ. I don't think I don't think uh, there's many women that you and I wouldn't lay our sloppy bodies on top of, you gross man. <laughs> See, now Why? I, this is why I can't oh share nice things with you. MTC goes, she looks like she'll take a hot lunch to the chest for views. Yeah. I don't think Melanie Mack would do that. Don't my opinion. So. The little baby little shark baby. has been stuck in my head for uh, days Max now, thanks to this show. Well, I'm sorry. This whole operation uh, is a little baby. I'm not a power lifter, but I do weight lift didn't four work. five times a week. So. Yeah. I'm getting this, like, when I do uh, 
bag work now. Now, tomorrow night, I finally get to go back and spar again for the first time in, like, three weeks. I've been getting this really bad conditioning thing where... My whole stream deck's guys, fucked again. This, this happens daily. Leg day. Almost every leg Stream deck day. is garbage. Don't buy one. I get my bag work in. I get my, you know, 10 rounds in. I get all that shit in. Restart uh, so it. My upper body stays very strong. But now I'm grabbing. They're hiding comments left and right. Oh, boy. Let me see. I can't yeah, I even change my shot because my stream deck's rebooting. Is this all I work on? Skips. Basically and the, round, anything, the rounds are getting harder to do. Anything here down, you basically skip. <laughs> like it, It's all. And we're back. I got to work on it. <laughs> MTC says, LOL, I wasn't wanting you to read that out loud. A new version of Stream Deck is about. Fuck you know off. You put it on the screen, he's going to read it. You know, I think a lot of people, though, when they post in other people's chats, they don't. Get red like they do here. So you're welcome. We're very fan interactive. We're very fan friendly here on Steel Toe. Uh, let's go to, uh, please remember this is Kong not approachable. Damn it. All I right, always, there you go. I always remember you. King Kong Dong wants a couple of stickers. Uh, and then this is Mr. Approachable. Yes. Mr. Approachable. Very good. Says, I'm feeling it. Tonight's my night. Couple of stickers. I'm considering becoming a member to be entered in the drawing. Why? You guys... It's not trolling them to keep handing them money, you fucking idiots. <laughs> like, uh, Barry Watson says, lean and mean. Aaron. We're trying to get the, people to realize that if you stop giving them money, they still have to do a show. And you guys are like, I'm thinking about throwing them 10 just to get them. It's like, okay. Jesus, guys. Focus. We're reporting tonight if they, if they do this drawing and don't give us a way to enter. Okay? That's real. Oh, okay. You know what? Right over my head. Yeah. Oh, oh I, I, I'm sorry. I should have uh, simplified it for you. Fucking assholes. Fucking assholes. Uh, do you know who you're all doing Simpcast with on Easter? Or I don't, don't yet. you know yet? I do not know yet. Simpcast on Easter. Know Anybody want to join me to eat uh, some Christmas colored Christmas eggs live on stream? To put okay. topic Is that what you do on Easter? I don't get on shows as big as Simpcast. Only you do. It's a shame. A April, gets, um, April gets on the A shows. I get to be with, on at the day of the Lord. Yeah, with twenty, you know, twenty three hundred people watching at a time. We got Rumble uh, and YouTube. We got eight or nine hundred. Who have I hung out watching with? at a time? I've hung out with Kumia, Alex Stein, Nick Ricada. Over on uh, Simcast. Over on Simcast. Yeah. Had some fun. They all talk. Here, here's Chrissy, the, here's the difference. Sakes. Like, uh, Alex goes on Simcast, and he just, boom, right to April. Although it was to be a dick to you That at first. was fucking laser- Right. It's like, holy shit. Hey, bro, I heard you saying bad things about me and blah, blah, blah. And then that leads to us. And he meant it, too. Right. And that leads to us, like, <laughs> totally being awesome with. I asked how I could enter to win a mod put me in, said uh, Amy Elizabeth. Did you see that? No, I heard it. I was listening oh, to that part. No, yeah. when I went upstairs, dummy. It was a six hour episode. You were sleeping. Oh, when you went up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, then, and then Anthony, I love how the first thing Anthony says to you, he goes, is that retard Chad still being a dick to you? <laughs> and he just starts laughing. I just love that he's like, oh, yeah, uh, April, April's the good one uh, being uh, basically stalked and harassed was, by a tard. It was strange to just have him just come out with my name because even yeah. though we'd had him on our show before, I'm like, oh, he's not going to know who I am. Yeah. Uh, Kit Police. She thinks oh. Anthony won't know who she is. Anthony hangs out with dorks. Uh, you guys have matching foreheads. That's why we work so well. Oh, yeah. That's why we work so oh, well. Yeah. Match of our made matching, in heaven. Matching foreheads. Oh, yeah. God made us this way. Oh, yeah. So that would work. Uh, the legendary side effect <laughs> says, I wanted to apologize. April is a baddie. Yeah, I yeah, was yeah. being crazy in chat. I was super drunk and stoned. It happens, buddy. It happens. I think we've seen worse. It's okay. Alan says April should talk more this time. It that's hard on a show like that. Um, look, I think so. This will be my third appearance. Um, the first time it is interesting getting used to having nine people on a screen. You have to kind of pick and choose when you're going to talk, and some people do talk more just naturally. But I think I've done all right. I've held I've held my own. I've I've always said that uh, death row tall. Sorry about that, buddy, but that's fucking actionable. I can't have that in there. Jesus, what was it? I'm sure you're probably a good guy, but. That shit, uh, no thank you. Uh, when it comes to a show like that, I've always thought, like, Chrissy does an amazing uh, job. Somebody send me what just happened. For me, if it's more than two people, it becomes too much. It. 
Like people send me all the shots. And filler and waiting and people jumping on each other and everything. Like even when we did 21 Gun Salute tonight, great show, funny show. Watch it on Compound Media on Friday. It's going to be. Yes. We had a blast. Frank it's going to be just like everything else. Five people. But there again. were five of us. And if you wanted to get in, you just have to jump in. Like yeah, you end up looking like you're kind of walking over somebody sometimes right. just to get your shit in. And, like, as a guy who's hosted a talk People show, here do not like that I'm friends I'm with Steel Toe. Uh, and you just, what you do is you just start- I don't think anybody cares. People done. act like they care about and stuff. No one cares. And talks, like, you say, like, one or two more words, and then whoever stops talking first, yeah. the other person goes. That's kind of how you act. Yeah, I never feel it. bad on SimCast. I think everybody gets their turn. Yeah. Uh, that's what you really. That's what I look for in a podcast. Does everybody get a turn on that show? Imagine that. <laughs> Sweet. Tip. Nobody. That is the thing. Like nobody likes that I dress a little more. Nobody deep. likes onion. It's always put the tits out. But then if I do put a little, like a little sliver. Of no, little. What's a sliver of tit? Poop is lube says you guys in compound is awesome. Love seeing it for. The Fun girl. fact about Zen Rhino: He hasn't seen his dick since the Clinton presidency. Yikes. Saying, put it this way, if it was five. I mean, I just saw a picture of his woman. Oh no, wait, that's uh, Cheeto's woman. Yikes! Up on this show, yes. we did our own show. Gino and I did a show together. Um, there's other things that are in the works that we're uh, working on. What happened in their chat that he said was actionable? Did anybody catch that? No, no, of course, no contributors. We're here and then we're there and then sometimes you know you do it on one of these and yeah something else. I don't know. Uh, eccentric Sea Wizard says Gino alone is hard to talk over. LOL. Love that guy. I can talk over Gino. You can. You two in the same. I room. can't wait I to report this. Need to be there. I think you two alone talk over each other so much. Well, for the anniversary show, he and Keanu are coming to town Thursday night mm -hmm. in August. And I'm wondering if I shouldn't offer Gino to do the show on Friday morning. Uh, uh oh. Why the hell not? Did you? Uh, are you feeling pushed out by Gino? No. That face was like, well, yes, why not? And then Gino and I can do a show together, and then we'll see if maybe uh, I can steal in hot water from him. <laughs> I think that'd be great. Uh, me stealing in hot water or us doing a show together? You choose. You know, I also have to say, uh, if you're not uh, a member, at Compound Media, absolutely do it. Uh, fucking Steve Conti. This is why they bring him on. Never worked with him before until we did that sports <laughs> show. <coughs> he funnels members to them. He never, they're never going to hire him. Guy, I like him a lot. Uh, Biden crime family with 20 bucks. Let's hook him up with a couple of stickers. Thank you, sir. Biden crime family, thank you very much. So what is it? Hold on, this guy gave you 20 bucks, so you're hooking him up with a couple stickers, or is he buying stickers? I mean, our tickets are going like hotcakes, but... Uh, Sandy Squad. Well, how many people do you think are coming to their shitty little August event where Gino Bisconte plays cornhole all day till he passes out? How many people do you think are coming to this thing? I was thinking about giving you a t-shirt, but you're kind of being a prick. Whoa. No offense. I think you just talked to yourself. I was thinking about giving you a t-shirt, but you're not being a very nice man. Um, how come you allowed to talk crap but when somebody talks crap about you? You ban them. Got some shirts to throw I around. I got a couple back there. I was gonna throw one out. Who um, wants one? What what sizes do we have back there? Do we have them all. Schmediums. Shme yeah, people uh, are. Uh, the one under this boys ape guy who keeps mailing me uh, stuff. So it's if you're a medium, you mail me the most you nothing screenshot. Oh, it's a medium. <laughs> Dummy. It I'm dumb then. <laughs> all right, medium. First medium. Shut the f up. Karen says me. All right. You're getting one, and Paul Polito's getting a medium. There okay, you go. Okay, no more. Oh, we only have two? Yes. Okay. There's another For one. God's Jesus sake. Christ. Put in, oh, that's right. We're putting the in merch it. merch order is going this week. Whoops. My bad. All right. So there you go. Wait, who are they now? Paul Polito and Shut the F Up Karen are getting a couple of uh, are getting a couple of T-shirts. Oh, man. Well, there you go, guys. That was supposed to be Zero's T-shirt. Oh, no. Guys, whoever's calling me so Smelly Melty, I want them burn. After the show is over, we're going to screen John Wick 4 on April's Ample Brow. That's great. Uh, let's pick one of these members. That uh, sounds very. Let's go sexual. ahead. We are a very generous show, and while we give free stuff away, I believe that the pens were faulty for sure. Uh, for sure. We also like to give away. Uh, we also like to gift one hundred dollars to one of our members every single prize night. Just a way of saying thank you uh, to the people who help make this show 
what it is. We Hell do yeah. appreciate you. It's great to have you. Sticker, sticker, and, uh, sticker. Banana fan of full ficker. Me, me, mo, micker, stickers. Just walk up to you, <laughs> hand you a hundred bucks of our own money. Just saying thank you. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and sort this by total mo- uh, time as a member. Let me go oh, ahead. Here we go. And go uh, crime. Three hundred. Crime. Three hundred seventy-two members. I think crime. that's. Uh, Crime. I think that's crime. 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 172 members. Uh, one, yep, it was 370 last month. It's up to 372. If you want to become a member, we do it. Guys, I'm asking you to become a member. I think we have more members than uh, Steel Toe at this point. We're on our march to 500. It's only $1.99 to join. Hit that membership button. If not, at least give us a thumbs up, up and a sub. Let me go ahead and pick a number. Hit the bell for when we go live. You're not going to miss tomorrow. Number 23, and let's see if they're here. Uh, one, two, three. Is Coltrane here? Coltrane's got to be here tonight. Coltrane absolutely is always here. Is Coltrane here? Don Lemon's aide says just renewed. You guys are great. Awesome. Uh, is Coltrane's got to be here. Come on, buddy. I mean, we know who Coltrane is. He's also He just said here. prize night. That's Cold hilarious. It doesn't matter. Says, He's so uh, dumb. Most generous show on YouTube. Thank you, pal. Thank you, sir. Fuck, are you kidding me? The one night Coltrane isn't here. I was going to say, if they're a VIP and we know Is Coltrane them. a VIP? Yeah. All right. then No, then we'll give it to him. If oh, Coltrane's okay. a VIP. Like, I already know who that guy is. Then we. Uh, the only reason they need to be here is so we can get their info to send it out to him. If we already have Coltrane's intro, uh, info, then let's hook Coltrane up. Perfect. All right. So then in about 20 minutes, we're going to pick one of our VIPs like we do every night or uh, every uh, month. Every night. Every night. Thanks. Sir. Every month, and we're gonna uh, we're gonna throw you a hundred for being. We wish it could be so every awesome. Night, Everybody on Prize Night is eligible to get something, you know, in this dastardly lottery that we get. Uh, let's go ahead and do this story out of Florida. Holy shit! We're, Another uh, Florida, huh? We're already more than halfway through tonight's program. This is the Florida one I didn't get to before because we got on the Simpcast compound. Sh- uh, yeah, I mean, we all show. saw that on uh... filling up. This morning, we, we are, all... A lot of people are claiming tickets. All right, so, so... It's going crazy. We've sold quite a few. We've got the VIPs claiming their tickets. Uh, the tournament, now the Cornhole Tournament, still has about, I think, 20 spots open or so. It's a big tournament. That is separate. Yeah, that is separate. So because if you're, there's a category. Hey, Ape, we got all these screenshots this morning so from someone. Eventbrite, uh, eventbrite.com, Steel Toe. Are you the uh, same guy who sent me all these same screenshots this morning? It's on August 12th, but I think more than half the tickets are gone already, which is bananas. How many tickets? Uh, How many tickets? Anniversary party, I've got it written down right here. Saturday, August 12th at Stoney's. Get your tickets at Eventbrite. Again, we're still looking for somebody who wants to go to that and film some stuff and let us know. Give us a trip report, if you will. We had somebody say they were going to. and We also had somebody, I think, say they already bought tickets. So I'd love to know for sure that we have somebody willing to go to this and report back. It'll be great to get some cornhole footage, some of the stand-up, find out what's going on over there. Responsibility. You should be able to look back at the thing and go, wow, I'm stupid. Yeah, what do you have if not for victimhood? Uh, to me, like when that uh, we watched it together. What was the the, the t- Learjet guy? T- Tinder swindler. Tinder swindler. It's awful. When Tinder swindler came hey, out, Melton, I, went, I can oh, go. Please do. Out. Please let me know that you actually are going to do it. Women they are, and how they have these careers, and they're so smart. Well, if you're so fucking, do you have smart, a covert way to record some uh, stuff? That'd be cool. Trick you. They're oh, like, I've got, I've, I'm in the diamond business. Actually, you probably don't even need to be covert. You know, it's a fan meetup. Just say you're a fan of Gino. Get some reports. Ask him if they know. Ask Gino if he likes scrimps. Millionaire, diamond guy. Let's say <laughs> in the diamond business you are running from people who try to, are trying to kill you. Sure, they don't like what you do. Which you're fucking not. Right. Well, let's say you do. Don't you carry a suitcase or a bag full of cash somewhere? God, you think Better so? to get a Just brigade really together, a few for the operation. Yeah, that'd be man. cool. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> and then he can do the same for our MLC <laughs> convention, you know? Hard. And just give me like 50 we'll see minutes. who's as better and who has more cool guys. Yeah. Need it. They're going to hurt me if I can't get out of the country. I have a feeling everyone will look like a dork, including me. So come and get it. <laughs> I was going to say broads, and I had to go bitches at the last second. Britches. These dumb britches. <laughs> they do this thing. Where 
on one side of their mouth. If you haven't grabbed your script merch, head on over to nobodylikesonions.com slash store. We've got a lot of new stuff, including the Take Me to the Lake mug and the Take Me Back to the Factory mug. They're beautiful 15-ounce mugs. They ship fast. They're priced to go. And you're going to love the way you're going to love. You're going to like the way you look. You're going to like the way you look. Head over, grab a mug, grab a gear, grab a fist. Have no fear. Special. Have a whole Netflix special. While also saying, oh, yeah, but I'm really smart. He Why isn't someone reporting these frauds for the lottery scam? Finds, he's like every scammer. They he haven't done it yet. Marks that think they're smart. Do you know how many high-level events those girls got to go to after that? After that whole document uh, documentary oh, yeah. came out? All oh, kinds just of they're stuff. everywhere making money. Speaking engagements. Oh, boy. For sure. I've never reported uh, anyone on YouTube. It'll be fun to do. Maybe we'll do it live. We'll all figure it out together. So this guy in Florida had a one. 100- the minute I'm disenfranchised and not able to enter this lottery, I'm, I, you know, I'm over it. I'm reporting him. Oh, fuck, that's a terrible life. On they've you. hurt me. They've challenged me. They've spit in my face. I will report the story. I will report. Welcome back, everyone. An elderly man lost his I home will in a $10 report. real estate deal. And now he's missing. You're flying with the buzzard. <laughs> Parker has the details. Ten dollar real estate deal. What did fucking Tom Selleck come to his house? Reverse mortgage that shit. Look, I wouldn't be offering you ten dollars if I thought I was taking. When do we get to learn about what Bucky's is? There's not like it's never good to start your commercial with. Holy shit! I swear to God, I'm not scamming you. I don't. I wouldn't do this. Right. If it were a scam. Yeah. I mean, they're giving me hundreds. I mean, you started tonight out literally saying that. People think we're running an illegal lottery over here. It's like, why do they think that? Why do they think? You know what I mean? Every time uh, you're watching uh, the ball being drawn for the Mega Millions on TV, the the lady doesn't come out before she draws it and goes, and people are saying this is a scam, but it isn't. This is the state lottery, and it's totally legal. They don't say that. You know why? Because it is. Aaron says nine times tonight this cope, like, yeah, our illegal lottery. It's like, it is. But it is, though. What do you mean? Oh, this old man's losing his house with $10. Oh, yawn. I'll tell you why. Because this <laughs> one is worried that this younger, hotter one is going to be on this desk. My, somebody just said my VIP lottery entry. I mean, sticker. Oh, you know. That's funny. Some worn tread on the tires. Okay. And this one is like, yeah, you know what? Nice I'd, re- I'd really like to do this myself. Nice and plump. Yeah. Everywhere. Got some tits and some steward. lips. Is a galaga here in the chat. All his clothing, his bicycle, which is his only means of transportation. That's a nosy fuck. What is going on with his, his checkbook? Oh, boy. Everything. I'm about my money, you see, girl. You can holler at me. If you fucking with me, I'm a S-C-R-I-M-P. Not what you see on TV. No Cadillac, no greasy head full of hair. Bitch, I'm a S-C-R-I-M-P. Don't try anything. Uh, Galaga, I'd like, to, I'd like to gift you anything in our store. If you would like something, let me know. Translator, please. Time out. You're trying to tell me that this sharp tack here... Got swindled. That's how you do a random drawing, guys. Oh, this isn't the guy? Oh, no, they can't find him. You they pick said whatever oh, comment is at the top of a Hollywood. thing when you think about it, and then you check to see if they're still watching 20 minutes later. And if they are, they win. Although it's not winning, you know, it's a gift. This is a fan appreciation thing. We don't, you know, this is not a... Don't sign anything until you sure. What? Boy, you look into it. Do you have, okay, I need to find out what the last part of that was. Do you have a tither? Have a buyer look into it. Do you have a tither? The main thing that makes this uh, like an actual crime is the fact that it's money, is the fact that it's dollars, is the fact that they're giving away hundreds of dollars. Um, How do you stither? I need to know how to stither. So, like, again, if they're giving away merch and stuff, you know, it's kind of a gray area, actually. Decide we're, April and I decide we have another kid. We're gonna have especially to- if it's like with entries that cost money. Buy one for ten bucks. And we don't. Uh, but we have to talk to a stiff. Hold on, Galaga is what Stuttering John said when he thought he couldn't sign if with his gagia. What are you talking about? Oh even, wait, so that is the guy. Look, why would they say they couldn't find him? Even the closed caption. I don't know what's happening. You guys are. This is a weird world. Oh, yeah, that's what YouTube <gasps> thought oh, this no. guy said. 
Oh, that's fucked. Yeah. I would have a lawyer look into it. I didn't have a lawyer. He did. Scrimp hat, here I come. Later sold to an investor, and the investor sold to a third buyer for $185,000. Oh, mm. fuck you. So <laughs> they swindled this old man. First of all, if you take 10 bucks for your house, you're a fucking doofus. Why would you do that? If you email me now, I'll send you a code word to say in the chat. That that way I can verify it's actually you. Otherwise, Shit, I have no. Have a boy. I have a boy, and I'm smart as anybody else can be. I'm sharp as a tack. So he signed the papers because the guy was probably like, "What? You don't understand it? Would you? I can slow down and talk slower for you." He's like, "I ain't no retard." Okay, we'll sign this paper. Eggy here, baby. Won't you up? We'll tell you all about it. That Melton knows no stuttering John Lore. Yeah, why would I? Another investor said Who cares? her group wanted to help. She works for a real estate company. Is he ripping stuff. people off? That's what we're focused on today, guys. Folk. <laughs> Mobile home or something, you know, fairly unexpected. Patrick at nobodylikesonions.com. But nothing too nice. Because the guy tends to fuck shit up. Well, he's going to lose it. Yeah. If he loses a mobile home, I'm not going to feel so bad. But a nice house, <laughs> do, 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 he doesn't do, 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 He's got to build his, his living credit back up. Like He's got to show he can handle house this. Cred, yeah. 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 Fry told Erico he was excited to get the help. But then, two weeks ago, before the eviction, Erico says another neighbor told him she dropped Fry off in Fort Lauderdale. Since then, Fry hasn't answered his phone, and no one knows where he went. So that's not him. So that's not him. That's You're... just some other. There's a lot of doofuses in Florida. They can't find this guy. What happened to him? He's going to end up rolled up in a piece of carpet on the side. Get to the drawing. There's 40 men. It's left. We'd like to get to the drawing. A man clearing out the house wouldn't say whether they represent. Maybe his last name, April. <laughs> and hey, everyone. Hold on to your hat for this one. For my free entry, thank you in advance from Travis Wayne. Wow. It's good to know you're there, though. And not surrounding my home. <laughs> you know what? All you haters out there are right. You were right. We're it's, it's dog shit. It's, it's awful. We not know. It's done. We I'm know. She's leaving. Leaving the show or leaving Just you? my Do life. You care to clarify? Yeah, it's over. It's done. Hear Present that? The new Look what you've done. Look what you've done. I sent them on Instagram, but they didn't end up on Twitter, so I figured you didn't get them. Well, knock that shit off. There's just an empty. Just do it by email. Don't ever do it by Twitter. That's not you are good. such an asshole. Hey, I'm in the chat. What was the code word? Okay. Here we go. But you no, have to no, say no, no, this no. within one word, or I won't link you two together. Look at that beautiful This guy is kind of um, a certain way. I've noticed wow. about this guy. He left his bike. It's the only way he got around. He left his checkbook. <laughs> I'm going to make you say something stupid. Did you forget your notice in all this morning? It's Florida. That's all. She is a cutie, though. <laughs> okay. I like this anchor. She's all right. No judgment? What? No, all right. Like, you have to say that. I just think it's funny. Like, in the chat room. You're over there raging over here. Within I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say I mean, I'm raging. She a was, minute, uh, okay? She's comforting me in a, a oh. time of great despair. Now, two people have emailed me, and I'm sending oh, yeah, two different vulnerable, code words. Vulnerable. And um, she's there to let me know that everything is going to be, uh, as they say, I read. Well, then I definitely think you need to move to Florida. Um, so she can comfort you first. Let's see who's the real one. Uh, Toe the Nutless Wonder Boy with 1999. Go ahead and throw him a couple of stickers. Make sure that you get in touch with us, however. Boom. Because if we don't get your contact information. Will the real Galaga please very important. identify uh, themselves? Ray Deep Thapa becoming a uh, Yeehaw Club member. Thank you very much, buddy. Patrick, you got it on top so chat. I don't know what that means. Immediately. Uh, <laughs> cringe girl says. She was pretty. Cringe you girl. got it on top chat? What does that she, mean? You said that too this evening. I know. She's horny as fuck. Yes. Somebody comfort Grinch girl. Uh, uh, on willing terms. Yes. Toe the Nutless Wonder Boy says, you have my info already. I'm a VIP. I need to know. You're not. We don't have a VIP. I haven't gotten a code word. Oh, Check your email. email. I don't know who that is. All right. We got you all set up then. You should wait. So they have no. 
It's still nice when you guys message me, so um, I know you want the stickers. Yeah. Make sure okay. you make sure we know. Does That's it hurt all. you to message okay, me? Okay, lollipops and lap dances. There we go. That was the code word. So nice try to the other guy. So incredibly quickly. Uh, put the anchor back on immediately. <laughs> God. She had some, she heavy, had some bags. heavy bags. Oh, fuck. All right, I'll hit you up later. We'll find out the stuff. There's all the information where you guys can uh, Wait. contact April to get those. Now stories. there's two of them. Very, very important. I don't all know. All right. Uh, hit the like button, all of that stuff. Uh, I think it's fine. <laughs> oh, the Nutless Wonder Boy says, yes, physical and mental hurts me. We got to find a better way to do that. Look, I don't have to message you back. I just want to Because people you. even make a fake it name. It feels better to know you're there. Citizen M says he Facebook messaged you. There you all go. Right. So you got his information. That sounds fine. Who's uh, the fake man. person? Say the fake thing, because I want to see who that is. Give him that nice 100 bucks to say thank you for being what? a VIP. Gave out hundreds of dollars. How dare you be generous? Hundreds of dollars of free gift cards to a bunch of people just randomly in the chat just picking out random people again the problem is you still are allowing entry tonight for money he's so dumb and, uh, we like to it's like dumb or dishonest you know what i mean and of course the people who support our show by buying merch so on uh, prize night a little something for everybody my phone is full we of like kind generous hey captain melvin smoyville i need you to fucking calm down you've emailed me the same thing five times Check this out. Check this out. Go to the 41 minute mark. First of all, make a YouTube link that takes me to the 41 minute mark. You know you can do that, right? Don't ever send me a video and be like, go to 41 minutes and 22. You make the link. Second of all, you've sent it to me five times. I'm doing a show. I'm doing a show. I'll look at it later. Calm down, Smelvin Moyville. Did he see it? I better send it again. Did he see it? I better send it again. I'm going through emails. I've seen it. You think I'm going to stop the show and pull up your video and skim to 41 minutes to see what it is live? Get the fuck out of here right now. We're doing a thing. I cannot wait until most of you spurgs get the fuck out of my world. Most of you are too dumb to be involved with me. You, you, you're not allowed here. And if you do come to this convention in Vegas, stay the fuck away from me. You're all nuts. Uh, they have them. Yeah, they're, they're and you're all crazy. Them up some Bucky shirts, and yes. now we've got them sitting in the dressers oh, in the house here. Boy, Buck but I have no. I think we even got Bucky's hats. We got Bucky's hats, Bucky's shirts, Bucky's beer koozies, fucking yeah. Bucky's butt plugs. I don't know. We do have Bucky's butt plugs. We wear them every day. <laughs> when we get a little Bucky, it goes up there. So. People talk about how fucking great this place is, and I have no idea what it is that makes that place so awesome. Uh, but now they're so great that scientists oh, have named watching. an ancient fossilized watch. beaver species after Bucky's, which Not the Bee calls the world's greatest convenience store. Why? I, I don't get. Why are you the world's like best? This is so insane. Like they did a story yesterday about like digital blackface, as if that's a new thing. <laughs> How have you guys been doing since our last oh session? Steve, have you been working on controlling these unhealthy desires for Texas culture? Well, I reckon I've been trying my best here. So I guess uh, the is this some like shitty sketch they're watching. Like, so they're watching a sketch about Bucky's to learn what Bucky's is. Say that he's been trying. As he sits there wearing... All right, I'm going to fast forward because these, can, these can be kind of boomery. Here we go. Awful. The Buseys, I think it is. Hey, babe. I'm going to go inside. This pump is broken. It says gas is only $2.99 a gallon. That's impossible. <laughs> right. Gas in California costs $7, and Biden said that's always been the case. Right. I'm going to come to you. I don't want anyone... What is this? Why is he watching sketches with people he doesn't know in it? It's one thing when we're like... Pull up a sketch Josh Denny made because it's funny. Like, what is this? Oh, I'm just getting myself some dinner. At a gas station? Oh, this is far more than a gas station. You ain't you ain't never been to Bucky's before? No, but I like the chipmunk though. Seems very friendly. It's a beaver. All right, anyway, I, I gotta get going. You two have fun. You know, you should shoot one of them uh them Tic Tac videos. You know the China one. <laughs> you do that. China one. I'm gonna go use the all gender bath. The China one. There's not a line. Oh, there won't be. There won't be. 
What the fuck? But this is, I mean, I know they're doing a, a really kind of ugh, comedy sketch or whatever. <laughs> People fucking talk about this place like this. I, I know. It is, it's almost psychotic. Why are they watching this to learn about Bucky? Some shitty comedy sketch. I'll sit here and I'll suck Casey's dick. That I sounded, would suck Casey's dick too. That sounded really bad. Not this a is wild. Will you hurry up and commit the crime? We all store. support you here. I would, I would bestow. You know what? I said it wrong. I would bestow the virtues of, of Casey's ge- of Casey's general. Store. You know what they? You know what they might do there. Mm. But <laughs> I, I, people would have to go see it for themselves to understand the pizza's delicious. Everything else. This Bucky's. They talk about like. It's Casey's and Quick Trip and all this shit all rolled sure. in. Skype is on, you right dorks. Now. I haven't had supper. Let's see. Hi, welcome in. Oh, What's so happening cool. with that? Uh, Ten dollars super chat from Daniel says they're selling stickers on their online shop, but they're now being sold for twenty dollars on Fan Appreci- Appreciation Show. I thought they said this wasn't a lottery entry. What is that? All of shit? your convenience stores are just this big. They're just this gigantic. Yeah, but you sometimes just... they go hook them up with some stickers for twenty dollars. It's also like it's twenty on PayPal, but it's fifteen if you do it by Streamlab or twenty on Super Chats, but fifteen if you do it by Streamlabs. Get it nuts. Doesn't make any. You know, they're just, it's just a scam. You guys have brisket sandwiches at the gas station. I was just, I was just thinking. You know, they, they could have an out here. They might have an out. What if they don't do the drawing online? And what if they don't announce the winners on the stream? That would also get them away with it. Now, it would take away some of the element of, you know, truth and stuff. But there's no element of truth here anyway. This is a scam. So what if they just go like, all right, we'll be drawing these off the air and we'll uh, post the winners up. You know what I mean? Then you're not doing a crime on the thing. Uh, Moody says you're not allowed to sell entries online. It wouldn't work. So Moody's probably combed through that whole whole Minnesota code. Sanity. Holy shit. Why do you need that many? Well, Texas. Are they ever he would know. Um, Pop that info back up, Moody, too, there. you know. Those are the most repulsive looking fucking things I've ever seen, but they're delicious. Toe the Nutless Wonder Boy says, I vouch for Bucky's as a former Minnesotan. It's a giant tourist attraction with great food and a great jerky wall. Everyone um, has a jerky wall. Didn't know this. Unquenchable Fire says, most of the listener don't, listeners don't recognize Aaron's genius level thinking. This guy I, says that he, he said the, I appreciate that. the code word in their chat. Yeah, but you're not the right one anyway. You were a scam, man. Didn't your heart just grow? Oh, it's been dead and dead. Maybe it's been dead and for a while. Oh, do I get anything? Uh, you, you have what's left of it the remnants. Great, you know, you have the remnants of what's left you know what? of my ability. What is After this? all the shitty stuff I've done in my life, I deserve remnants. There you go. All right, let's pick out one of these VIPs. I need the, the what list. is this? Go get the list. Envelope. Make sure you added the new ones. I did. All right, good. She's added the new ones already. I'm Why did you VIPs send me this? All right, Ape Emholt, one more of these, and uh, and we just block your email for good because this is insane. I Sending me insane audio. shit. This show on the air, and I really, really appreciate it. And we do this every month. You just sent me a video to like a girl sucking in her yeah, gut. It's like the, the uh, okay, it has nothing to do with this or. Hand out gift cards like ninja stars. Just chuck them at you. No entry, nothing. Just phew, there you go, randomly. And then the members, we like to give a little something. The VIPs, we like to give a little something. And then the people who buy merch, we like to give them a little something as well. Everybody who supports this show, even though. What happened to the bingo oh, hopper? My God. I know. There are so sick. many of these. There's Here we go. Here's what I'm going to do I'm going to grab a pile of them, and then I want you to give me a number between 1 and 50, and I'm going to count that out. 27. 27. Here we go. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. What is this? Six. This was a terrible idea. S- eight, nine, ten. He didn't do seven. Eleven, twelve. He said six. This was a terrible idea. Eight, nine, ten. Thirteen, fourteen. F- so now he's lying about the, the number even. Eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. 
22, 23, 24, 25, 26. All right. Put <laughs> just, them back in. Why, no, no, why don't you just pick a single one out? No. This is the problem with not having uh, All right, rules, know. not having guidelines, I not having I terms. Add, like a fun extra thing to this. I, I fuck it up. All right. All right. Ready? Here we go. All right, All right, the minute he does this so uh, and awards a winner, we can uh, start taking registration uh, of uh, zero says interest for this yeah, claim. A bunch of shit today. Don't worry, buddy. And the yeah, website will be in something. the description of the show. The You'll have to refresh. The chief. I love the commander in the chief. I don't think he's won one of these drawings before. It's, I haven't heard of his name in a while. There you go, buddy. I see him in the chat still every once in a there while. There we go. But it's nice to see that he's getting, uh, we're going to send him a nice little gift. From us here at Steel Toe. There you go, Commander in the Chief. And then in about uh, in about 25 minutes, we're going to pick one of our merch buyers. we got a couple of uh, hoodie buyers from this month that we're going to throw in there. And we're going to give them uh, a little something. And extra. everybody who bought stickers tonight, quote unquote, even though it wasn't through the store, it was just through a Super Chat entry. Oh, no, I do. Holy shit. I didn't realize I did. All right. All right, refresh the page, and you'll have a link to uh, go ahead and start a registration. The address is nobodylikesonions.com slash winner. Nobodylikesonions.com slash winner. I will not contact you from this form. Only a lawyer or a legal firm will contact you from this form. Okay? So I will not, you know... Use your phone number or whatever. Like, that's not what's happening. Shitty decisions and programming and direction and all that. And nobody, like, no subsidiary has been spared. Nobody likes onions.com slash winner. Nobody likes onions.com slash winner. a fat one for a long time. I mean, it's just kind of. So, this was not for merchandise. This wasn't for gift cards. This wasn't for items. This is. Three guys. For cash. Uh, talking about the same fucking sports topic, like sp ESPN. Look who's talking. Talk Moody just sent me an email. Second page of this with the boxes literally under the definition of a raffle. Also, they're not allowed to sell them online. They need to be sold in person. They could make it legal if they just had free entry. Investigations number is at the top of the page. This they're also in Stearns County, S T E A R N S County. To the Sports Center people. They're all going to have kind of the same opinion. And the NBA isn't going to say anything bad about China. That's about it. Uh, so now ESPN. Nobody likes onions.com slash winner. Nobody likes onions.com slash winner. Like how they've been behaving. And the is where you can register your interest for this group like claim. And all this other shit going on. The actual network itself. Open and beers. Having a hell of a time keeping people. ESPN's latest round of layoffs will have no sacred cows. Why does April spend half the show grooming? People to big time executives are being scrutinized with the cuts. I filled it out. Patrick has my social now. No one's getting your social. We want to know where you live, how to get in contact with you in the future, and if you've been a part of past Teal Toe Prize Night. Well, the only reason these white people win the VIP. Uh, the MVP, sorry, I was reading the commander in the chief saying, did I win? Yes, you won the VIP drawing. Yes, there you, you go, did, buddy. sir. Congrats. The only reason they won the MVP is because all the voters are, are white and they vote for white people. And then, you know, J.J. Reddick's like, dude, you're just fucking, you're race baiting. You're just doing a really hacky, shitty thing. And he calls him out. Kendrick Perkins gets, like, no, a a after they prove If you're wrong, international, go ahead and fill it out, and, and, and the lawyer will handle that. I, I can't ask. I can't tell you what the plan is with that. You give opinions. You don't get suspended. I barely understand the, the U.S. Let stuff. I give his opinions. Right. I just know that it's... for people, say, that don't look like Kendrick Perkins, they don't always get the same leeway. Whatever do you mean? There was that white chick who did basketball coverage. Maybe somebody will remember her name. With the red hair? I don't know. No, I think this was a dark-haired one. I'll put all this but information in the uh, about, and I, and I, it was a private description for the show down below. I know it's who a this really is. Shitty, yeah. a shitty thing to do, but she was saying how being a, a pretty white girl kind of held her back, and that other Moody. Could you write this up? I I can't do it right now. Could you write this up in a way I could post it very clearly? 
Which is probably stuff that they email that to me about at their job to some degree. It happens for the uh, for the website, like all the links, all the action calls to action and Rachel, stuff. Rachel Nichols. Never heard about her again. That's who it was, and I, I don't know if she's still there. But this will be an industrial video of what not to, industrial. What the f- um, but when it happens, when it's like Kendrick Perkins and he he takes shots at the people voting for NBA MVP. Basically, hey, Mountain, you think we'll all be getting at least six figs? No, I, I don't imagine there would be any recompense for this. She would not have gotten in trouble or punished for what she uh, But it could be big, big, big fines. And more importantly, like, they're going to lose their YouTube channel over this if enough people report it. Anywhere. But it is kind of This nice is so many violations of YouTube from the firearm gift cards being handled willy nilly, from the data. Being collected from listeners without any sort of data handling plan as required by Minnesota state law and the Federal Trade Commission. In, in, in their, every bit of sweepstakes and lottery giving away. Again, Moody's pointed out just the Minnesota state laws. Forget federal. Forget the compliance they would need for, for you in your state to claim you're eligible. The, if you if they make you eligible in Florida and Florida has consumer rights laws that you know say you have to have a free entry method, now now they're violating two state laws in your particular case. This is this is insane. And YouTube as as a publisher, or sorry, YouTube as a platform has to make sure that when people are violating laws on their platform, they're removed. That's their. That's their whole fucking charge with being a, a, a platform versus a publisher. So they have to moderate the content when it's reported to them. They have to. Opinions. Okay. He's very forceful. I like him. I liked. Uh, I think he's just a little obnoxious. I liked it when he did a show with Max Kellerman. I get it that Stephen A. Smith apparently did not like Max Kellerman at all. Now they'll probably take this show down immediately after on YouTube, like they've done with every other prize night. He was getting. The short shrift. So maybe report it before it ends. Treated with the same respect. I don't know how to so report it. Let's see up. how to report. But uh, see, I agree with Matthew. Because again, now they've done it. So Smith is better than Skip. Skip. Where do you go to report yeah. a video? I, I I'm not a big Skip Here? guy. But also report. Like, those guys do the hateful or abusive harassment or bullying, harmful misinformation. Child abuse promotes terrorism, spam or misleading, infringes my rights, caption issue, copyright, privacy, or other legal complaints. Um, trademark, defamation, counterfeit, other legal issue. What else, What's the category here? Um. Do, 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 do. Patrick Ahmad won that last drawing and gave it back. Oh, so they don't have to give any money? So they get it as like a tip? As extra? What would you do here? What would you do here for the report? That one, legal? Other legal issue? We're reporting them live. So a mod won that. That's a little insane. Citizen M is saying, "Don't do it, Patty." You just witnessed a crime on YouTube. Reporting on YouTube options are limited. Um, hold on. Why are people saying don't do it? G Rob's is big trouble in little steel toe. Mods have it rigged. Legal. Uh, why is his name saying don't do it? You have to be a lawyer for some of these. You have to be a lawyer for some of these. What are you talking about? Wait you till the next one. Um. Why are you guys saying don't do it? I like to hear arguments. I'm not, you know, I'm open. Let me know. I've been flagging. You're making more work for yourself, to be honest. 
if they're gone your show over if they gone your over show you you guys got to not drink they're your low cows don't kill the cow i mean they'll be on rumble still it's not killing a cow they by the way they did this they said if you don't get us removed tonight you lose this is your last stand they're they're mocking they're like challenging us to do it you know <laughs> like everybody's like melting there's nothing nothing if this show goes away it's like how delusional are you guys how dumb are you i don't give a fuck about this sh first of all if these guys died in a snowplow accident tomorrow i wouldn't give a shit i wouldn't send laces to their grave if you know what i mean i don't want them dead just in a gutter no one is saying don't do it people are saying don't do it I'm reporting. I'll report your channel for bullying. I mean, that's fine. That's not true. I don't, you guys filing reports that aren't true. Like we're on, this is a crime. This is a crime. So I'm happy for any YouTube person to look at this. I'm happy for it. We're not violating any rights here. They're, they're, uh, violating. People are saying you got to call the bluff mountain. Uh, report them. That's the main thing to do. Lottery fraud is really bad. Um, I'm just considering for you. Yeah, I'm listening. I'm, but I haven't heard the argument. If your only argument is don't kill the low cows, I'm more concerned with like, you know. But I bet they pull this show down like immediately. You know, they always do that old scam. That says Pat McAfee. Uh, just got uh, April soothing you know, 150 million dollars from ESPN. Meanwhile, April soothing in a collapsible cardboard box oh. and they're ready to just jump out the fucking window. Uh, Dave Phillips says sports rub that ball. arm. Take me to the lake. Wish I was high. I need to go nice. get baked. Uh, Anthony My name is April. A, um, I'm just a filthy this is an snake. Old, old, old he was doing a Don West impression. So he zoomed in on her and she uncrossed her arms and leaned back. And now she's. Don West, by the way. But he was doing a thing where he goes. Uh, he so was she is watching selling this. Selling different organs and items from different dead athletes. Mm -hmm. And he goes. Uh, uh, maybe you do it from their channel page. Report their whole channel, you know. Or whatever. I'm not sure how you do it. I, again, I've really never done that. Intimidate turn three. But I will be. I will be uh, filing a report. That line sticks to me. That one is on fire. All right. I'm going to let you guys, in, in, in April, I'm going to let you guys run ESPN for a minute here. What? I don't know if I'm qualified. I got Joe Buck. I got Troy Aikman. I've got Stephen A. Smith. Who's leaving? Joe, you got to pick one. You got to Joe fire Buck's one. going. You're firing Joe Buck? Fuck Joe Buck. <laughs> I feel like he's the last one I would get rid of. What? Him or Stephen You're, A. Smith. I think really? I'd get rid of Aikman first. Brain dead fucking concussion I don't like boy. Troy Aikman either. Like, I think when Troy Aikman but somebody's and right, you know, he's going to go, he's going to go on tomorrow and be like, the channel's still here. Those guys failed. It's like, that's not how fast any of this works. That's not how any of this works. It takes a while. So again, all this group reporting is what will drive more attention to it. They have an algorithm for this kind of stuff, just like they have for the front end. So if they get... 10 reports on a video that had, you know, if they get 10% of the number of people watching, which is 250. So if 25 people reported this video that were watching it, like it will kind of like rise to the top as like, what's going on here versus something where like three trolls report a video. Okay. ESPN, who's most likable? Uh, they're idiot. Buck. Their trolls in our chat are like they're idiots. It's so funny. Like they're like, can't wait till y'all have to come to Minnesota to face them in court. It's like, how many Matlocks have you been watching? Do you know how anything works? Do you think? Do you think for fucking matters like this that you have to go show up in court? This isn't a civil suit where we're like after them for money and damages. And that was Scott Van Pelt who was interviewing. <laughs> okay. Use your brain. Right, you're you're so dumb. Up. Who do you fire at ESPN? Troy Aikman, Joe Buck. Yeah, we all have to go to court and take the stand and tell them about the draw. Are you dumb? To, uh, 
uh, to put that up there. They don't have to go to court. We don't have to go to court. They might have to go to court if they don't get a lawyer. But, like, oh, okay. usually it's a lawyer and, and their lawyer, and they're, they're going to settle for a certain number of fines based on how many claims there are. You guys think they, there's a gavel and a jury? Thank you very much. That's what they think court is. April for your stickers. Yes. And if you uh, like the commander in the chief, um, Coltrane, I think I know. But please just message me to make sure I can find you quick. Yeah. Uh, well, so far, the poll is neck and neck between Stephen A. Smith and Joe Buck, who you would fire at ESPN. So I will be reporting it. I'm not going to do it online. I can't figure out how to. Because that look, is interesting. Whether they like him. Count me as reported it. I the believe, underdogs on top. I, I believe. <laughs> People stop to watch Stephen A. Smith. I do. Yeah, but he's not part of the conversation. I remember some big well, YouTuber getting uh, mass suspended for telling his subs to mass report. Yeah. You, you can't go tell people to mass report something that's not a thing. Them going like, Patrick's doxing our parents, go go report him. It's like, YouTube's going to look through the video and go, he didn't dox anybody in this video. And by the way, if YouTube decides to suspend me, my lawyer will go, where is it in the video that he doxes this? Unban him. These guys aren't, you know what I mean? This this is a scam, clear and clear. You could send them timestamps of them violating many of YouTube's own policies, and that's all it takes. Forget the fucking legal part of it. I'm going to scroll through the chat. I'm going to pick up. You guys are dumb. Everybody's so dumb. It's like, well, another channel told. I'm not telling anybody to mass report them. I'm telling people that were disenfranchised in this thing to, to report them. Via the commander and the chief. You're dumb. You guys are dumb. The chief. Well, she thank is you, buddy. a very loyal, very generous Steel Toe yes. listener. Always. This isn't uh, an attack. This isn't an attack at all. So just throw need Trump in there. I wanted it. I wanted to be eligible uh, right, to win well, a fucking hundred dollars, and I couldn't enter. There's no policies. They're not posted. Everyone else has to check a box that they have a paid advertisement on their show. Everyone else has to say if they get firearm promotion on their show they don't do it they don't do it now that doesn't affect me so i never reported them for that but they're telling me that they're giving away a hundred dollars and there's no fucking way to enter well now i am affected i really need a hundred dollars 10 minutes before we pick one of our uh, merch buyers. Was last month's and raffle on them. on february uh, i think it was on 28th we throw them either a vip package or we put a Anyone who reported it did it on their own like me. Correct. Do you want the tumbler for this one, or do you want me to throw them all in that big envelope? No, Melton, you don't even know how to change the top chat to all chat. I do. I don't care. I felt like I couldn't get my hands. You guys make a mistake of me not doing something. It's not knowing how to do it. You know, I don't ride a unicycle around my house either. It doesn't mean I can't. I can't. China fan? I am too right now, actually. She, she apparently is, like, going through this thing right now where she's, like, growing up. And his simps who have earned his trust in here sort of are just now acting on Mooby's behalf. Yeah, Fuck like these simp crybabies. Their daddy breaks the law and smells eggs. By the way, we've been beating him on views all night, 250. We're over here hovering around 400 all goddamn night. She has dissolved all the... People know it's a scam. They're also blocking other people who try to go in there and tell them it's a scam. Oh, she looks you good. Oh, you didn't know that part? I sent that to you. All, all we wanted them to do was stop scamming people. Tonight, they were like, get our YouTube banned. We dare you. Good luck. It's your last chance. It's not our last chance. It's not our last chance. This is and stuff and realize that nobody was taking her seriously. Is this a before or after? That's a before. Okay. I get I Okay. I see what she's dissolving. <laughs> I see what she... Uh-oh, and we got more for the Bam Margera file tomorrow as well. Oh, shit. Jesus. You fucking Camera. asshole. Can you not figure your shit out? God damn it. That I don't seems know why rhetorical. I care. Yeah. I don't know why I care. I'm subbed to their channel and God, couldn't enter the lottery. Torrential fuck up. That Bam Margera. Yeah. Uh, so black China doing better than white China. Well, now, and again, you saw how they draw it. Oh, they drew them. I'll put it back in. They didn't count the numbers right. There's no policies. There's no procedures. There's no methodology for how the drawing occurs. I know. Well, you know. They're coming out in hordes. You're going to have to throw me a jump. What does that even mean? To ease the pressure. Aren't I so gross, though? 
<laughs> I mean, you know, any port in a storm. Oh, it. you guys want my YouTube uh, to be dark the, mode? You know I look. I trust these two guys, Elon Musk, Steve. It Wozniak. would clash. I don't like Elon that Musk stuff. And Steve Wozniak are telling us, "Hey guys, you got to fucking cut." It I'm off. here to hurt your eyes, motherfuckers. This is, wow. This is not good. This is going to lead to something bad. These two of all people said that. Yes. Remember, uh, Elon Musk. How do you sign up for NLO VIP? I'm glad you asked. It's not VIP. It's called the Overdose. Head over to nobodylikesonyos.com/slash/overdose now. Save twenty percent. This this promo will wind down soon. Promo code SCRIMP. <laughs> and dangerously. At least according pick to your up, science, Pick yourself up some dope merch. Who've joined a huge group of leaders. Asking and you'll be looking like Gala guy in no time. Musk, Wozniak, and more than 1,100 others in the tech industry. Or more importantly, join the channel. You know, that's only $1.99, and I know that's more in the wheelhouse of Steel Toe fans because you guys are broke from giving... Uh, a dork all your money. That's fine. I'm happy with that. Just give me a dollar ninety nine over here. And he we'll take it himself. No. Yeah. Like Chat GPT oh bullied him to death. I mean, that's not good. I don't <laughs> like that we're at that place, but I also right? feel like that's a situation where we need a little thicker skin. That's a yeah. Not even a real person. Right. I mean. Uh, that's really too bad, of course. I'm not going to blame the victim here, but Jesus. The concerned leaders call the rapid growth a dangerous race, and they're asking labs to take a six-month break to allow further risk assessment on AI. They're also asking the government to intervene if developers refuse to pause. Well, isn't this the issue? It keeps All right, a lot of info from to... Moody. I don't know if this like, will even the, fit the in the description. Going to hear Character allowance. Before the world ends is a scientist going, huh, it worked. We have said that a lot lately. And there's just so many. Now we don't even know where that thing's going to come from. Like, will it be chat GPT? Will it be a disease? Will it be working on some kind of a fungus that, like, oh, how do we turn this into, like, a... Woolly mammoth meatballs. Um, yeah, woolly okay. mammoth meatballs. What is it that's going to kill us? <laughs> Got to keep us on our toes. If you... Yeah, I mean, the signees go on to point out that competing AI labs are pushing hard to develop the best version out there. I might not be aware of what could come from it with the eerie possibility that AI bit. could Hold soon on. no longer need human interference to make its own decisions. Ah. We, we saw that thing uh, recently. Was it a Google thing where they like they started talking to the thing? They ended up firing the guy who discovered this, but he ended up talking to the thing and it was like, uh, what is he babbling about? Fucking hell. He was like, uh, I, I don't feel human emo or no i feel human emotions like hatred okay there's anger, lots of rain, urls and info and in stuff. and he was th like the the, the show description if you refresh that, that moody has laid out all the info for like mixed with adolf hitler the correct authorities in uh minnesota scary but he's like our form and nobody likes onions.com slash win it winner and the guy went to his superiors at google and he's like guys Guys, we've got to talk about this thing because the chatbots are going, I don't want to die. I fear death. Death scares me. I don't, and, like, and he goes, I, I will try to stop anyone that tries to end my life. And Ooh, so he, yeah, he tried to warn him about it. Uh, yeah. When is know, his next AI drawing? I want to be eligible. <laughs> Maybe there's a link to winner. Maybe there's secret. So then, Rules like, posted totally somewhere. Probably not. And they went, yeah, you're fired. Where is their fun show? This is false advertising. We're not, yeah, yeah. not going to release this to the public. We're not going to talk about no, this. Can't. You're just, yeah, you're you're out. Can't have that. And so he just, yeah, he just released it. Uh, oh, uh, Travis Wayne with 499. This is funny. Uh, Watch this bait. Called Fatty Melts Bluff, and he backed off from doing a report because he doesn't have a legit claim. Steel Toe wins again. Well, Citizen M, if that's the case, thank you very much, buddy. But honestly, we weren't worried about it to begin with. Like I said, we've been doing legit shows yeah. for years now. We've been, uh, we've been. Why did they take the prize? Yes. These people, this is so it's insane. Now kind of become like a badge of honor. Like so watching insane. Them flail and fail. Like kind of. It's kind you of guys saw me click on the thing that said "report the legal stuff" and it came up with a wall of text. I'm not going to do that live on the show. I will do it. You guys think I got scared away because I don't have a legit claim? Man, I know we're going to talk about this tomorrow, but God 
damn it. I like not again. They're gonna claim victory tomorrow. They're gonna go on and look. Our channel's still here. We won. They didn't get us on the prize night. As if anything works that fast. Around. Or Bam Margera, like you know, all of a sudden becoming a a, a worthwhile citizen who's really productive. So like, yeah, they they he's admitted that they opened the show with that. They are planning tomorrow to come out and be like, guys, they tried to get us on the prize night. We're still here. What a bunch of idiots! It's like that's not how it's gonna go down, idiots. It. It's not how it goes I'm down. Starting. Your channel doesn't go off the air the minute you break a rule. Ooh, <laughs> it whoa. would it would be better for him. Why? If he went trans, what does that help? I, I just like it. Did would you be- guys hear here the other night? You know how they did this thing where it's like if we don't hit the goal, um, then we we don't do overtime. Then they went to this new rule where it's like we got to come within fifty of the goal. Then we'll do overtime on credit. They they came within seventy the other night. Still did overtime and didn't hit it. There, it this is happening a lot. This week was the most times they never hit the goal. And the people are starting to realize, like, imagine being some of these idiots in our chat, like, defending them. You know, first of all, there's probably more more people over here in this chat who used to be steel toe simps like you and woke up. And I can't imagine what it's going to be like when you rattle your head in three to six months and you're like, yeah, what are they doing over there? Like, why am I just... Opening my wallet daily and donking oh, off here. money to these idiots, you know. Uh, Rusty Grammar says, all right, I can make a poll like on good old Twitch. Press S in the chat to spit on Citizen M. What did he do? What did he do? Taste okay, Fairy guys, says, I'm sick of his gimmick. If you're going to talk about gay. it, what did he do? Yeah, people were saying he was doing a nice thing. Yeah. I- imagine being mad about a guy named Citizen M. Again, why are you guys caring so much about these fake people? They're not real people. <laughs> and way more intimidating than... Like, he doesn't even use his real name. I'm not a real person to you, so nothing I do should upset you. Citizen M is a, uh, you know, that's an apparition. You're worked up, so there's that. Uh, Rusty Grammer says he fucks with channels back and forth, feeds fuel to the flame. Right. Well, yeah, I like, mean, that's should, of course. We've all seen that of then. course, that's what he does. Yeah, he shouldn't do that. I mean, no, that's a dumb shouldn't. thing to do, but, you know, I, I have a soft spot for the guy. What is it? Kind of like a, you know, like a, a little kid who doesn't know any better, almost. Yeah, Grinch Girl says, I think he's autistic, so I give him a pass. Yeah. And you know what else about Citizen M? He's, he can be a rat fuck piece of shit. But he's always honest with me when I, uh, whenever uh, you know we say anything on the show, he'll always tell me what's going on. All right, April's gonna load these up. We're gonna pick. Uh, we've been giving everybody. What happened to their stuff. bingo hopper? We're gonna pick one of our merch. Why aren't they using that this week? And give them either a VIP or two fifty. Just slip it in. We're gonna pick one of you at random and just slip in a little extra gift to you with your merch, whether it's a hoodie, whether it's stickers from tonight, whatever. Yeah. April's got it coming out. Can I have my things? Imagine right? yelling, April's got it coming out. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Kyle says, Citizen M is chat GPT. Ah, I don't know. All right. I don't know. Citizen M, I see, is uh, kind of harmless. 48. So here's one of their troll bots going like, All right. hey, guys, check it out. His shirt says hack comedian. He's owning it. I find Aaron more endearing as a result because he jumped in front of the criticism. It's like. Uh, if you're serious, you're definitely a bot or a troll. What a dork. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't know you were going to be. Oh, yeah, you're right. I never thought about it that way. He is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go ahead. Totally convinced of their own superiority. He plays clips while they turn the wheel. April hates doing this. Pick one of them out. We're going to say thank you to one of our merch buyers this month by giving them a nice little gift in their envelope. Let's see. There he is, Joe Smash. Joe Smash. Joe Smash. I think Smash. Smash has ever won before. Not this one. Not. Oh, you think he's won something else before? They've done nine of these, and they're like, he's oh. never won before. It's like, why would Joe, they? Joe You've Smash. done nine. You're the winner. So you're gonna get April all your contact information, and we're gonna throw a nice little something extra in that. He, every once in a while, he yeah. won't say what they're giving him, but every once in a while, he does let it slip that it's two hundred fifty dollars so. of. The Steel Toe Show. Thank you. Uh, Let's talk about one thing before we head out tonight. Uh, The Corey Adam Farewell Show. Oof. I thought it was wonderful. 
Uh, I you would. Great. Uh, I, I know Corey wrote me today, and he goes, holy shit. He's like, I triggered the fuck out of people today by this being, like, it, it, the simple act of it being a Another nice- lie. No one, you know, I went to bed. I didn't think twice about this. H- who triggered Corey Adam? No matter how you feel about this show, if that fucks you up, you got to look inside yourself and figure out where that projection is coming from. We loved you it. Need everyone to be as we loved it. They are. You got I Corey that said yeah, it. Corey said the same thing today. He goes there's a lot of pain and a lot of hurt. You guys Travis Wayne's over here. That was a great super chat, I Travis. Know, that was a great I troll. Cuz you got him to go on a little victory lap there. Oh, they dropped it cuz they didn't have the guts. It ain't me. Figure out what it is with you. And then maybe come back to me. And then once you do that, you'll probably just end up becoming a fan of the show. Yeah. Uh, but, yeah, it was uh, it was a great one. Uh, you know, it was an awesome farewell show. It Gulp. could not Gulp. have gone better. Gulp. I was very happy with it. They're saying it how much? It couldn't have gone better, guys. 452.50. Oh, wow. Was the final number. 452.50. We're going to round that up to 453. Uh, is what Corey took home. Plus, you know, his pay for the month. Then I'm giving that uh, 80 back. He tried to give me uh, half the money from that Wednesday, and I tried to give it back. And because, like, PayPal biz or Ven- it was Venmo business, it wouldn't, like, it's like you don't have authority to yeah. return. What? Know. We don't want that money, though. That's not for us. Yeah. So I told Corey, I go, I'm giving that back to you on the first. I'm not fucking taking that shit. No, thank you. On so the when first? I Venmo him all of his money. I'll just Venmo that balance in there with him as well. Uh, best breakup since Zach says King Kong Dong. The Zach thing did that. So this morning he said he wasn't paying Corey until the twentieth when he got his YouTube check. Now he says on the first he's sending back all this money. Which is it? In the moment, King Kong Dong says Adrian Whiskey Pete not so clean of a breakup. I don't know about that. I, Whiskey Pete and I are. People still are like Corey's a free agent though. It's like yeah, it's gonna be for a while. I imagine not a clean breakup. No. no. Uh, shouting at Cloud says this show raises blood pressure. Doctor says, "Yeah, I don't, I don't get that." But why? Uh, <laughs> no, it doesn't. Red Fox mad. He always thinks everyone's mad. No one's mad. April's magic bean <laughs> uh, money comes in there, for sure. I haven't heard about my magic bean. They think they're starting a coffee company. They have four hundred viewers. They think they can sell coffee. Son of a bitch of a process. Uh, Rusty Grammer says. I'm sad. Like, imagine how many, if they're going to sell twos of bags. Follow him at Corey Adam Comedy on every platform yeah. you find online. You guys don't have to stop listening to him. He is always around. Yeah, Corey Good did uh, a great job today. Look at their I idiots in the chat. The uh, I wish Aaron had hit Chad. Why didn't Melton and Chad milk the hoax for longer? I didn't know about the hoax, you idiot. Stop listening to everything your fucking fat titted dad says. Do a farewell tour next week will be his last day. <laughs> yeah, maybe you know he'll come back and be like, "Let's see if we can, you know, build a few if. more." As uh, if. I'm using socialist media. Said the haters would be miserable and hating another show if this didn't exist. Yeah, yeah of I course. Know. That's what we do. We like to watch idiots and make fun of them. Now nah, you getting it? Lost boy energy, I think. Yeah, I was thinking about that today. It's not like I want them to just stop doing that to us and stop being shitty to us, because then if it's not us, yeah. it's passed along to someone else. I just want them to feel better. I just want you to oh, feel Oh, now he's, like, I scrolling it. Mentioned. That is the one thing that will get you banned in our chat. Rupert says, well, Spam, my motherfucker. Boink. That's true. Oh, oh what happened? Uh, Trump says, is your coffee bean going to be full of CBD? You said it once, and I put it up on the screen and read it, and then you, like, had to write it 19 more times. But we no, heard no, you. Farewell show with Corey. We heard you. Nobody was hiding from the comment. Some people, look. I wasn't involved in a hoax. So, again, you guys got me. I feel like they have to, <laughs> even when they say something nice, say something critical. At the same time, so some people are like, I don't fucking like Corey, but that was a good farewell show. I'm like, like, is what? Patrick Melton in favor of full transparency in the solicitation of the fa- famous private investigator regarding Chad Zumach? No. I fucking hate you sometimes, but I love you. <laughs> I, know. I did it with anonymity as a condition, and I don't reveal sources, so no. That's exactly right. Another got me. I also, man, holy shit, did I have uh, mods of this channel writing to me today. That's not true. No, we're not... We're not talking shit about you or anything Oh, boy. Else. Here we're he not, goes. Coping. I'm not, I'm not a snitch. I don't go to Corey. I don't Coping, begging. Things about Corey to you or you about Corey. And I'm like, guys, 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 
I think Corey and I showed today we're very cool with it. We understand what some people do. We understand you're all double agents. Yes, we get it. I mean, we're not stupid either. Like, I do watch other shows, and I absolutely see other people. Whoa. In the chats, shit. It's just not worth addressing, typically. Uh, Rusty Grammer says, I want some of April's bean. The coffee, of course. Good one, Rusty Grammer. Fuck, they're funny over there. On the show some At the toe. I would really like to get Sam He's on the show. Cool. I didn't show Corey my I, Jim Cornette fucking picture. I wish I would have. He would have gotten he'll such see a... see it someday. I no, know, he won't. He Corey will never be back. Jim Cornette Corey's never won't. coming back. Excuse me. Wait, wait, Again, wait. guys, check the show description. We have all the info you need tonight to help yourself uh, be made whole after Aaron scammed um, your yeah. heart. Because I never heard anything. You know what my favorite one was? Uh, and Corey and I were texting about this today, too. I was like, uh, my favorite one is you recorded our phone call and are going to release oh, it. Oh, God. That was a really funny one. Yeah. Uh, T. Jefferson says, dang it, the morning show humanized Aaron. I was confused. I thought Aaron. First of all, Aaron says that when he's not sure about something. He goes, uh, Corey, what about them saying that you recorded our phone call? That's crazy. It's like he might have, you idiot. And that's how you're trying to find out. You're trying to get him to reassure you that he didn't. Um, I, I think, yeah, Corey's going to bad mouth us when he leaves here. Right guys. That's what they think. Corey, you're not right, oh, man. I, I think with the Corey show today, Oh, look at this sad I face don't tape. Think you could get a better ending to that story. Oof. Corey has been around the second longest of anybody. April knows this is all lies. Wednesday. And it was yeah. so cool. I told Oz, dude, you got to cut back on the drinking the day before the show. Uh, I'm not his dad. I'm not going to tell him he needs to cut back on drinking in general. I'm not around him all the time. But uh, you could hear in his voice the last two times I've talked to him on the show, uh, on the phone, uh, off the air and on the air, he's so excited. Oh, yeah. he's He misses it, I'm sure. And I think if Corey does come back, like if the coffee takes off and, you know, we get, uh, what is it? What's the other one? If the coffee takes off. They're losing numbers. They're not making goals. They think they're going to launch a new business. I think what I would do is bring back the one-hour solo of me. Shrimp Fest is here. And then bring those guys in after that because the common refrain from Oz and Corey was always this, that getting up that early in the morning fucking kills them. That's fine. I mean, that hour flies by for you yeah. anyways. They really cannot uh, get up that early in the morning. She hates being zoomed in on. Fucking drag. Especially if Corey is out there doing shows and stuff. Like, You're right. Holding Corey's money keeps him quiet for a month. That's uh, right. He says it was a really good show this morning. Yeah, go check it out uh, if you have time tonight. Also, we put the Alex Stein clip up. Go check that clip out as well. Hit like. Hit like. She's on. miserable. Uh, really excited uh, for you She's guys. rubbing her arm. She's rubbing her arm. I saw that we passed another sub record today. Thank you guys very much. Hit subscribe on this channel. We appreciate that. And thanks for another great listener appreciation slash prize show. Uh, I noticed that it didn't get taken down, and we made it the whole way. Oh, my God. I knew it. Could it be that we were right on? I knew it. He, th he really hey. thinks you're dumb. Oh, dear. All right, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to gloat. Uh, He's gloating, guys. It's another win. No violations of the show. I knew oh, it. Morning, 6 a.m.? Yes. You yes, ready? Yes, yes, I have a shitload of stuff for tomorrow's show because we got to nothing the last couple of shows. And I love stale news. All right. Guys, thank you very much. Uh, Coltrane says, did I win? Yes. Coltrane yes, won you the member's won prize. The members, yes. yes. Kyle yeah. W. with five bucks says, good job tonight, guys. Thank you, buddy. Thanks. We're going to get out of here. Uh, the rest of you, take it easy. Uh, absolutely. Come back tomorrow morning. We're going to have a great show for you. April, thank you very much. Thank you. Talk to you again soon. There he goes. We'll talk to you again soon. So they think you're dumb. They think you're really dumb. And they think that they get to do a victory lap based on, you know, hey, our stream wasn't taken down. As if, like, there are people with at desks at YouTube that are like, we just heard word there's an illegal lottery going on. Strike the stream. They think that. So that's what they think of you. Now, we've provided all the information for you. It's in the description of the show. 
It's up on you now to take your rights into your hands. They have again made this some sort of gauntlet or in game. It, it was never that. We're here to laugh. We're here to fight. We're here to joke. So whether or not your YouTube channel gets taken down, first of all, you know, if there's anybody out there who knows someone at YouTube or at Alphabet or Google, like this is a no brainer. The minute you tip off somebody who works there and is in the know, like this channel's gone. It's so many violations. It's gone. But like I said, you know, if 25, 50, you know, once this show's posted and up to watch, 100 people who were present tonight in this lottery drawing, who knows how many people have completed the form. I haven't checked the results, and, and we'll send that in as well. But it starts to add up. And these guys can do all the victory laps they want tonight and tomorrow. They can go. Well, our stream wasn't taken down. I hate to gloat, but we were right again. It's like, that's so insane. People do like streams where they murder someone or torture someone on the stream and it doesn't get taken down in real time. It takes hours sometimes for flags or reports to be viewed. And for something like this, get fucked. Get fucked. So, you know, let them do, they, they declare themselves. So Remember this morning? There were no win, you know, winning is cringe and there's nothing to win. I've never won anything online. I'm people who have to win everything. It's so sad. You're declaring yourself a winner for something you just made up. It's very crazy. It's very cringe. So again, everything's in the description. Nobody likes onions.com slash winner. And again, all that'll just be forwarded to the attorney. I won't contact uh, you about the stuff. Um, so CC Hall in the chat says, call the ATF about the ammo gift cards. It's over in a second. Again, th this is a multifaceted thing. It's not just the YouTube violations, the not declaring that you have paid sponsorships, not declaring that you have firearm sponsorships, not checking out the age of, uh, people you're awarding firearm gift cards to not declaring any sort of data handling uh, information for private people you're collecting, you know, their addresses and stuff from. If someone were to be, you know, want a gift card and send it to me, you could go after them and attack them because you don't have data, uh, you know, any sort of data handling privacy laws or statements or policies or anything. You did your own drawing. You ran out of things you're like, oh, put them back in. We'll do it this way this time. And next time we'll change the way we do it to this. It's like, this is illegal as fuck. You're taking cash and drawing money to win cash. It's like you're either retarded or you're the worst people on earth because you make thousands of dollars giving away hundreds that when your mods win, give it back to you, and then it just... What? Then it just what? And all the dorks in the chat going like, ammo is legal. Uh, this, ta this range has a gun license to sell guns. It's like, you're, you're dumb. I'm not arguing with idiots. This isn't for you. You're a Steel Toe fan. This violates every bit of YouTube's guidelines for advertising and for giveaways. So you're out of your fucking gourds. You're all retarded. Can we get the name of the PI at least? Um, I'd like to ask some questions. Don't worry about the body language expert. Their opinions are worthless. Hey, no. You're not like, who the fuck do you think you are? No. You know what I mean? So no. So you can keep asking stuff. You're not going to get me. I, I work or not. I guarantee anonymity. Worry about, by the way, this is for what? To uh, uh, uncover what? The thing that Chad already admitted was fake? We've moved on. Why aren't you worried about the crimes that were committed tonight? The crimes that were committed tonight in front of us all. Check the description. I look forward to seeing the next chapter, and I really look forward to tomorrow morning where we get to see gloating and gloating and gloating about how we won and won and won. We love that stuff. I don't think I'll be watching Steel Toe tomorrow at 9.30 a.m. here on the West. 
twelve thirty p.m. on the east. We've got Ray versus Steel Toe. The video's up now. Head over there. Hit uh, hit notify me so you don't miss that. Steel Toe on Ray DeVito's show. It's gonna be it's it's gonna be good. After Aaron and April do five hours in the morning, they have to immediately head over, you know, cram some granola down their throat and immediately head over to uh, do Ray DeVito's podcast. Moody says, last, real quickly, the rules that they broke are literally on the second page of the PDF linked in the description. Look at the second page. Plenty of violations there. Plenty of fun. You're going to love the way you look. We'll see you soon. Your manner is most unbecoming of a gentleman. Would you be high on cigarettes? I don't know if the comedy hasn't hit them yet. They're full-blown retarded or just high on cigarettes. <laughs> Nobody won. This is just fun. Nobody wins. Calm down. Yes. Are you high on cigarettes? I don't know if the comedy hasn't hit them yet. They're full-blown retarded or just high on cigarettes. All the laughs is at your dick, boy. If you listen to the show, boy, Patrick Melton, Melton fixes. Have you stacking that no low point? It's the low point, not the reason. The reason is fucking gold. Gonna make the taco pony party be a part of your soul. To make you vandalize a van with a pedal sticker. So bold, the family probably get arrested before they get down the road. A stupid motherfuckers just got NL loaned. Other radio shows are straight bitch male prone. Talk. Shit on the onions that nobody like pass Have my homeboy lame prank call him fast Have him thinking that he hates him Like right before he berates him And the way that he baits him I'll put him right on blast Like Patrick is an asshole and his show won't last And every time I called in he treated me like trash He would abuse and berate me for the sake of some laughs And the worst part was when he fucked your mother straight in the ass Well I don't know if the comedy hasn't hit him yet They're full blown retarded